Why is pain court not working? Oh my god. Well, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, Happy War on Christmas, Feliz Navidad, um, all of that stuff. But this is... I got a... Stupid goddamn... Man, Pink Horde, you used to be cool. Anyway. Welcome to the Crimbo stream. We are starting with one of the least Christmassy games, but it is... It's specifically a Christmas game, so whatever. I just wanted... This this message came up before. Um, this was in the chat, like, days before the stream, and I found you. I found you out, Artie. You thought... You thought I would never see your stupid comment, but I did see your stupid comment. Thank you very much. So, I want everyone, before we begin the stream, I want you to put on your sexy Santa outfits, your sexy uh, Hanukkah outfits, your sexy Kwanzaa thongs, um, whatever. Just wear whatever your particular culture's sexy winter holiday costume is. Please put it on right now. I am, of course, wearing my Mrs. Claus dress and Santa hats. And uh, we're all ready to go. Pajamas? Is, if that's your culture's winter holiday outfit, then yes. Anyway. So, I found out, I figured out a couple things. This game is incredibly loud, by the way. You can't really tell, but I had to turn it down. Um, I have newfound powers. Oh, why is that? What? Wait a minute. Hang on. Let me do that one more time. Why is that coming from the wrong speakers? <laughs> that should be coming. Oh man. Whatever. Uh, you can't win them all, but whatever. I'm naked. Thanks, Doc. Very cool. So I'm starting with this game because uh, recording it is a nightmare. It's um. Let me give you an, an image, a relevant image rather. Um. Hi, Sonico. So that's what the game looks like to me, and I can't increase the size. Um, bad things happen if I increase the size, so don't, don't even worry, we're, this is just how it's gonna be. Shift, none. Nothing equipped. I can hug a wall and press control. So I thought, my brain thought this was Flash, it looks more like an RPG Maker game, but I don't think it is an RPG Maker game. Oh, we got the codec. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no! Uh, not enter? What's the button? Nick, it's been a long time. Tiny Tim. Oh my oh, god. They stopped calling you that 20 years ago. Just Tim will do. 20 years. Well, Who is this Alfred? 20 years since the Ebenezer Eve incident. <laughs> you the gotta be kidding me. Since then. Military surveillance it's crafts have been me. circling the skies in response to the 9 11 attacks six years ago. <laughs> That's why oh it's my far god. Too risky to let you deliver the presents the traditional way. The traditional way. <laughs> you can't risk having you spotted soaring through the sky on a slip. 9 11 really dropped out of the zeitgeist, Tom. Is, there's far too great of a chance you'll be branded a national threat. So that's why I'll be delivering gifts by foot, I presume. Precisely. Colonel. This is a top secret covert mission. From this point on, I've been mean we'll to play this for like a billion years, years, by the way. My code name will be Major Tim. <laughs> and yours, Nick, will be Solid Santa. Solid Ground control Santa. to Major Tim. Has a nice ring to it. <laughs> so what's the mission? Your mission is the to solidest Santas. Listen, I wish you the hardest Santa that Christmas you can handle this year. Located on the topmost floor. Sounds easy. It's <laughs> not as easy as it sounds. Most people are asleep at this hour, but a couple of naughty, naughty children might be wandering around. It's really got that nice gravel voice. Morning. So that, I get uh, to throw snake coal at them, right? No. This is above everything else a stealth mission. You must not be discovered or the mission will be a failure. Do whatever it takes to stay out of the enemy's field of vision. To make things easier, you'll need to make sure that I'm trying to deliver to presents. I'll be giving but you I'm a dummy thick on codec. milk and cookies. My frequency is over and the festive clap of my ass cheeks right. keeps alerting the elves! Operation Secret Santa. <laughs> this entire game was just. That that one line is the entire reason this game is exists. House entrance. Let me reiterate that this is the smallest thing in human history on my screen. Why was 640 by or 480p like the standard for? Oh my God! This music is so loud. Um, why was that the standard for like a billion years? We, we didn't get until HDMI. We didn't get jack shit. Uh oh. 
It really is like a Metal Gear Solid game. You can't even walk down a single fucking corridor without a codec call. Santa, wait. You want so that's what you lo everyone loves about him. Walk up to a wall and press the arrow key towards it. Mm -hmm. You should start to hug the wall. By hugging the wall, you can see what's up ahead. But I'm, I'm dummy wild. thick. How is this gonna help? What is this? Happy fun land? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, hello, jo this the mouse really emphasizes <laughs> the, g the gigantic mouse really emphasizes how incredibly oh oh shit oh fuck <laughs> why is there a gunshot did I just like murder the child or did I murder myself all right control against the wall oh Santa wait well, oh fuck <laughs> I gave him the 16 tap that time. All right. I got it. We got to wait for him to turn around. All right. It's a sneaking mission. Oh, he's got a gun. Do I get to snap his neck? Please tell me I get to snap his neck. Come on. I don't know how long these are. There's two of them. Um, as long as they're not crazy long, which I don't think they are. Uh, oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Listen, the children, I can take them. I don't need to sneak. Multiple shots because Santa makes sure no child gets left behind. The house. Second story. How many, how many children these bastards blast out? Wait, what? Oh, you can knock! Which is a really bad idea and I shouldn't be doing. Man, what is this? An evangelical house? There's 500 kids in here. Oh, you gotta be. <laughs> How many kids in these bad? Oh, this is the knocking tutorial. Do people actually use that crap in in Metal Gear Solid? Hey. What was that? Must have been my imagination. So how's everybody's week been? It's it's the, arguably the big day. Now, do who? Who here celebrates on Christmas Day versus Christmas Eve? We oh, always kind of did most impossible. of it on Christmas Eve. I know there's no easy way past this one. Santa, Christmas Day, we just went over the grandparents and ate lots of food, spirit. and that was anyway, that was Christmas what? too. Simply that you possess the power to turn on a television just by thinking it. Mm -hmm. To do this, move your mouse cursor over any the television set on button. the map. You can turn it on by clicking on it. Any children with an earshot of the television will automatically. Turn <laughs> <towards> <laughs> <it>. That's that <laughs> is how children work. Yes. Of the television screen. This is amazing. There's gotta be a kind of hole. Well, the thing is, you can't turn them off. A five-year-old child has the attention span of a goldfish. <laughs> Unless you can change what's happening on screen, he'll lose interest in a couple of seconds. And I'm guessing I can't change channels, huh? Afraid not. <laughs> what a useless power. <laughs> this is just like an indictment on children. Right. How do I use brain power? Oh, I gotta click on it, right? Oops. Does that exist? No, Santa Claus! <laughs> you gotta appreciate the love that went into the ridiculous, very necessary uh -huh. voice clips. What was that? What was that? Alright, so I was supposed to save that for this. Alright, easy. Oh, sorry, the mouse. The giant mouse is still on screen. Anyone get their presents yet? I said I'm waiting until tomorrow to do presents. Because almost Christmas, god damn it! This is why you don't make control a primary button. I keep opening the menu. Oh, I got a gift! Santa, it looks like you found a new item. Yeah, but it's just a gift box. I got plenty of those in my sack. <laughs> my sack? Gift box? What do you mean? Colonel, that my sack is elves. dummy thick. holes. That's right. That gift box was specially designed for wearing. Wearing. The giant yes. mouse is I perfect for such bright and the shine. The yeah, they inventory, are very cute. I just posted a new short of them. Once you've equipped an item, you can tap the ship key to quickly put away or Parker take still doesn't like them, but I think he's slowly getting more comfortable with them. It's a disguise. As long as you're not moving, you'll look like an ordinary gift box so the children won't take notice of you. Wait. Aren't children attracted to gift boxes? Well, that particular gift box is full of bombs. It's full of bombs? If you believed it is, would you approach it? No. Then yes, it's full of bombs. That doesn't make any sense. 
Don't worry about it. They're five-year-olds. They'll believe anything. We're just giving mental suggestions to the chillins. All right, how do I shift? Santa Claus. Santa Claus. Oh, God damn it. Santa Claus. Uh, third story, West Wing. Santa Claus. What? What? Santa Claus. They got freaking ray tracing over here. <laughs> Claus. All right. Does anyone know how long this is, by the way? I don't want to. I don't think it's crazy long, right? I just don't want to get stuck too deeply stuck on like stealth Christmas puzzles. That's not quite the reason for the season. <laughs> Was the cardboard box ever good in Metal Gear Solid? I never played the very first one. Santa Claus. Oh, Santa Claus. Santa Claus. But it's usually pretty useless in most of the recent games. Like, I know it's a joke item, but... I always figured, like, Claus. at least speedruns would use it, right? Exist? No? Santa Claus! <laughs> 15 or 20 minutes? Alright, that sounds funny. Fifth store? How big is his house? Oh, hey, he lives in a Zelda dungeon. That's, that's pretty cool. Santa's little oh my helper. god, it's Pliskin! I, I know I recognize that voice. Anything, but if you want to get out of this mission unnoticed, you don't have much of a choice. So maybe it's just best if you believe what I say. Well, did this game need this much dialogue? I guess it did. It, this, this really does fit the Metal Gear Solid vibe. Santos L. Hopper. What do you mean? But since when does Santa respect gravity? What the hell is that? <laughs> what the fuck is this philosophical bullshit? <laughs> what is happening? I'm Santa. Am I gonna do this at every house? This will take like a hundred years for a single year's worth of presents. Okay, I believe you. So how am I supposed to get past it? <laughs> so much dialogue. <laughs> you didn't even tell me! You didn't even tell me! You gave me a 10 minute cutscene and you didn't even tell me what to do. God damn it. I'm set off alarm. Oh no. Wait, what? Mommy, does that exist? No? Santa Claus! <laughs> okay, so I gotta, like, disable the- Yeah, I gotta disable the security system, because, you know... Regular homes have a proximity security system. Especially in 2006, or whenever this was. I love how they all have little tiny guns. At least I think they're-, they're Maybe that's just red neck? I, I don't know. I thought they were holding, like, toy guns. Santa, it looks like you found a candy cane. There's very yeah. few pixels, though, so it's but hard to so tell. What's special about a candy cane? That's no ordinary candy cane. Oh my god, do I get to beat the children? Seized candies. That's right. That particular candy cane is a seized candies brand. <laughs> brand. Since hey guys, have you heard about NordVPN? What? Didn't someone warn you of a laser security system that was invisible <laughs> to the human eye? You're telling me that eating this candy will help me see those lasers? <laughs> oh my god, seized candy. Can? Fuck you. What's get caught out. What if I don't believe? Well, then this entire mission will be for nothing. What? Santa, the most important thing about Christmas oh is Oh my believing. god. You cannot... I don't have time for this. Oh, by the way, I'm being extra festive today. Um, in addition to the Santa hat, I also turned the lights... Because I have smart lights, I turned my, um, the lights in the room to red and green. And also white, because it, it looks bad. <laughs> it looks bad with just red and green. But it's festive. Um, alright, shift. Oh, it's the, <laughs> it's the cigarettes! I just got that. Delightful. 
I love how the cigarette kills you in a matter of seconds. <laughs> Metal Gear Solid. Like that's some that's some propaganda right there. Woke, the wokes. Oh god damn it! I'm about to be seen, but the wokes don't want you to smoke and kill yourself. It's just propaganda. Very upset in the morning. Did you just step in a pile of coals? Yeah. Why? You're going to leave behind footprints. No. Why'd you have to step on the coals anyway? Giving out coals is my job. And the <laughs> my only job. That's allowed to make children cry on Christmas. Damn, I'm good. But you'd better get out of there and fast. Milk and the cookies, will follow your motherfucker. Footsteps. Wait. Now the children are going to try and steal my job? I said follow your footsteps, not follow in your footsteps. You <laughs> This is so mid 2000s humor. I'm just going to keep smoking. Oh shit. Oh fuck. The gun sound. I'm just <laughs> I'm just gonna keep smoking, I guess. Colonel. I'm giving myself cancer from this candy cane. Oh shit. No, the press <laughs> the press against wall has not Oh Oh you slut! How dare you! How dare you use your eyes? You can't a guard in a stealth game that can use his eyes more than five feet. That's, you can't do that sort of thing. That's, that's not a, okay. It's not acceptable. I guess I was supposed to use the peak thing then, huh? Just as I was insulting it. I guess you do need it. Alright, we're good. D camera. Hey guys, do you want to see my D? It looks like you found a nice digital camera. Camera. What good is a digital camera? A stealth machine. <laughs> well, you can use the flash as a distraction. That's brilliant. How do you come up with this stuff? When I get bored, I think of ways to annoy children. Really? <laughs> no. Based. No. But how am I supposed to take photos of them without being seen? That camera is equipped with a remote control that can activate it from anywhere in the same area. Press the control key to place the camera. Once it's set, Man, this is what Metal Gear Solid 4 should have been. This will blind anyone within sight of the flash. However, you can only use the camera six times in one area. <laughs> Why? Why? Film. Oh. Gotcha. You, you get more film each area, camera, of course. People go investigated. If a guy has a digital camera, camera, it will automatically go off. What are we gonna do with the pictures <laughs> when the mission is over? I'm sure I can figure something out. Ah, yes, what? pictures of children. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Oh, oh shit! Oh fuck! Oh, I'm good. Sandin wants to know how to take pictures of children without being seen. I mean, who doesn't? What? Wait, where did I get? Santa, it looks like you found oh, I found a gun! Yeah. I found the end bomb. Well, Fucking Santa Claus is about to bust out what? the end gun on a bunch of unsuspecting children. This is the most hardcore Christmas ever. To fire a dart, let go of the control key. To fire a Keep dart. that you've got a limited quantity of darts. What happens when I run out? Well, your darts get refilled every time you enter a new area. Wait a second. That's completely unrealistic. Are you seriously complaining about realism in a game about Santa Claus? Well, rude. Wait, what are you implying? Nothing. Bye. Oh, sorry, giant mouth. Santa Claus! <laughs> Santa Claus! I love the gunshot when I smash the entry key. Alright, D camera. So I have to, like, deploy a drone control the place on the ground. That nerf gun. Wait, am I actually gonna just murder these children? I mean, you know, pleasantly. Oh! Oh, I was too close. You actually get to take children out. God bless America. <laughs> now that's what I'm talking about. What the eighth story? What is this, like, 12 days of Christmas tall? What? What? Wait, wait, what? The, the, the children hiding? What? They must have seen me from there, I guess? Huh. Oh, lasers probably. Yep. Uh. 
Come on. Wait, what? Oh, god damn it. It's control, not shift. Amazing controls. <laughs> it's the wall of NPCs that block you in Pokemon. Oop, uh... This is... <laughs> I guess... I guess that's fine. They don't really care. They're kids. They're like, ah, yeah, my brother's, you know. What? What? I guess I need to use the remote flash. Missing here. Can we get a. Oh, god damn. Santa Claus. Santa Claus. My favorite, like, unnecessary blocking you in thingy is, um, in Mother 4. Or Mother 3, rather. Um, I mean, there's a bunch of ants on a path, and it's like, no, you don't want to upset the ants. Uh, is there... Huh? Okay. So, I'm assuming I gotta use the flash on this, right? Unless there's a TV. Wait, what was up with the TV thing, by the way? That was relevant in, like, one thing. It's never come up again. Oop. Hey, oh! Damn it. Damn it! I keep pressing shift. Alright, I think that's it, yeah. Huh? Who was that? Yep, yeah, that's it. Santa Claus. What? Oh, come on! What the f How dare you! How dare you make me treat it like a stealth game instead of a puzzle game? That's that's just mean. All right, I know what I'm doing now. All right, this is the fake out. Or, no, no, that's the real one. All right. Huh? Who was that? Oh. Hey there, happy war on Christmas. So I need to. Oh, bitch! This is just mean. Please tell me there's only 12 floors. That's what I'm guessing is the gag. Because I do need to be a little bit quick about this. Oh wait! Oh god damn it! I have the Nerf gun! What am I doing? Alright. Spreaking me to learn two things at once. That's, that's, that's too, too many things. At least I'm speedrunning. Huh? Huh? Oh, God damn it. Mommy, does that exist? No? I don't Santa like this map. If it, if it wasn't frustrating, it wouldn't be a stealth game. You gotta, you gotta give him that. <laughs> Make absolutely sure he's fucking destroyed. All right. What's the gag here? I'll never get sick of dropping children. Oh, <laughs> you gotta look at, you gotta look at the painting or window, I guess. But, oh, 
God damn it! I, I saw that the first time too, I just didn't think about it this time. If I can get past this kid without using a bullet... I don't think I need to waste that bullet. Aw, oh, bitch! <laughs> is this Die Hard? Yes. This is literally Die Hard. As I posted on Mastodon, uh, I don't think that Die Hard is a Christmas movie. I think that Christmas is a Die Hard holiday. Oh, hey, Rays. Yeah, take pictures of them cats. See, they, they did this just because I was complaining before. I was complaining that there was no points to the peak function, so they're like, yeah, I'll give you a reason to use the peak function, bitch. <laughs> Eventually, Santa loses his shoes. Oh shit, oh fuck, it's temporary? Wait, what? Mommy, does that exist? No! Santa Claus! Wait, 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 what? Oh, god damn it, don't, don't make control, oh. At least not in this program, control is not a safe thing. Oh, sorry, mouse, giant mouse. So, what? Damn it! Oh, no, I think it's not the button, it's... When a level starts, it, like, puts me in the menu if I press the wrong button. It's so weird. Wait. This can't be the right way, right? Fucking waste that kid. No, I'm sure as soon as I walk here, I'm seen. But but if uh, the gun is temporary, right? I don't get how I'm gonna keep these guys down long enough. gonna have to trust that these three can stay down even though the other ones don't oh bitch <laughs> this better be one of the last levels this is <laughs> the, the shit post to game ratio isn't quite right honestly it's a little bit too difficult for what it's asking of me. But honestly, I feel like lots of old chip post games were like way too hard. Like they didn't really, you know, cater to the fact that you're probably like just gonna play it for like five minutes at most. They're back up! But, uh, what? How do I do this level? Well, what's... what? Santa Claus! Mommy, does that exist? No! Santa Claus! I think I'm gonna have to give a skip on that. Let's just watch the, the closing cutscene or something online. Um... Mary Gear Solid Long Play. <laughs> no, not metal. I <laughs> I wrote Mary Gear. You stupid fucking website. Mary Gear Solid Long Play. Secret Santa. 
I, I asked. I didn't ask for a Let's Play, but whatever. So blah, 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 blah. Where are we? Oh, that's like the last level. God damn it. Okay, well, let's see what he does then. Wait, what? Oh. All right, well, let me see. I already closed the damn game, so it's probably too late. Ugh, thanks for screwing up my resolution when I open you. Uh, no! Not new game. I don't think there's a continue feature. Yeah, I, I think we're just watching this one on YouTube. Ranking quick game. Yeah, this, there isn't actually a continue function. All right, so we're we're watching on YouTube. Oh, oops. Um, there you go. No, no double chat. Merry War on Christmas, everyone. The presents are moving. Turtle, what the fuck? Oh, hey, it's Metal Gear Snake. We rescued him. Oh my God, this is gonna kill Santa. No, this is the real War on Christmas. You. That's right, Santa. It's me, Solid Snake. You probably know me as Santa's little helper. <laughs> really? He did do the Pliskin thing. I was joking. What are you doing here? After taking down Big Boss in Our Haven, I was sent to drink gravel for 30 years with my big brother, Big Beard. Oh my god. So <laughs> Santa is liquid. Okay. I'm not voicing all of this. The Los Bigotos Perfectos Project! <laughs> yes. Amazing. Top secret project, Andrew Johnson. <laughs> Wonderful. L listen, this is no more crazy than any Metal Gear plot. I, I Think of a single Metal Gear game that makes any more sense than this. Not counting the MSX games, because I never played those. It, any Metal Gear Solid game, let me put it that way, not a single one of them makes any sense. Big Beard. <laughs> it's just actually the plot of Metal Gear Solid 1. Oh my god, Jack and Joe. Oh, just Jack. Oh, he didn't have Jack. <laughs> this is relatively straightforward for Metal Gear Solid. It really is. For instance, we didn't get to meet a group of a conspicuous group of five members that we kill time and by time. <laughs> Poor Kazuma, like he doesn't want to make a video game, but he like realizes he has to make a video game. He's like, ah, yes, Metal Gear, yes, Metal Gear. Big Santa. Oh my God. <laughs> Santa's going to threaten the world with a nuke. Gene, <laughs> listen, genetically speaking, Big Boss was predisposed to threatening the world with nukes. So because this guy has his genes, obviously, we have to contain him. That's definitely how it works. That's how it would work in a Metal Gear Solid game. Like, like that wouldn't be a joke. Like, he would have a gene that makes him, like, hate English or something. Happy Christmas. Metal Gear Acid? Oh, I never played that one either. Isn't that the card game on PSP? Well. <laughs> Alright. I didn't want to spend... I didn't realize that was the last level or what it kept going. But we do have a bunch of other stuff, so I wanted to get moving on here. Uh, all of it is Flash, and all of it's going to like look like this, because... <laughs> well, I can like zoom in at least. But yeah, Flash games do not... Capture super well. Christmas tree light up. Ah, oh. you came here for the middies. Don't even lie. You came here for the damn middies. Oh, we're Bioshocking, aren't we? What was the What's the original game that does this, by the way? Wait, what? How that? Um. 
Everyone knows it as the Bioshock thing, but there's like NES games and stuff that do... So it's not possible to get all of them lit, or... I'm having difficulty in it. Children's... <laughs> Children's Santa game. Oh, maybe it is possible to light all of them. Pipe Dream! Pipe Dream! Or Pipe Mania. I think I think getting all of them is is possible actually. I can beat a children's game, goddammit. See, I'm smart and cool. Pipe Dream on some platform and Pipe Mania on others. Oh, don't you love that Oh, Oil's Well! Oil's Well, yeah, I remember that one. Was that even earlier? This is super quiet now. I'll turn it up on my end. That 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 last game was just like incredibly loud. Too loud for Christmas. Oh, speaking of too loud for Christmas, my neighbors have been like screaming at dogs and each other and just generally being weird like shit beasts today. So I don't know what the deal is, but oh, you win. I can beat a children's game, hey! One out of five, come on. Come on, that was, that was a speedrun world record right there. All right. Is this gonna work? Oh, dress up, who? <laughs> I guess the sound doesn't emulate. Ooh, the frame rates. You gotta have a little bit of uh, the old flash. Ooh. Oh, it's crusty. Oh, it's crusty. Why is this of all things not working? <laughs> Subject your neighbors to Dennis Prager. Can I unmute the music? Uh, this Okay, this one just like doesn't work. You you get the picture though. It's it's a dress up game but for a tree. Dress up who? Well, this one might not work too. I don't know. It's very laggy. Oh. Oh, it kind of works. Hopefully, is this. this <laughs> well, hang on. F f first of all, we gotta get some music! Oh yeah, NORAD! Hey, let's go open NORAD! You better watch out, you better watch out, you better watch out, you better watch out! He's making a list, he's checking it twice, he's gonna find out, he's gonna find out, he's gonna find out, he's gonna find out, he's gonna find out! That's right. Is the NORAD Santa site down? I just get a... I just get a hash. You better watch out, you better watch out, you better watch out. You How many nuclear missiles out. do you think are tracking Santa at any given time? He's making a list. He's checking like, you know it's not zero. Like, do you think one nuke would be enough to execute Santa, or would they need more? NORAD. So NORAD's site is, like, broken or something, I don't know. Maybe open too many tabs. Let's see if it's faster now. That's a bit faster. All right, come on, Google. NORAD. NORAD Santa. Let me just close these other tabs in case they're killing me or something. 
feed cookies to a bunny girl. Well, I like the sound of that. Oh, I see. Oh, oops. <laughs> cat picture. Let's see the cat picture. Go to site. Kitty! That is a thick boy. This, this is a bit extra fluff. So a lot of people think Parker's fat. He is not fat. He's actually been dangerously skinny until a month or two ago. Um, got some new meds for him, but he's absolutely not fat. That is what a fat, uh, long-haired cat looks like. See, the NORAD. NORAD does not seem to be working. No, no, red. Does anyone, can anyone else open it? Uh, I don't have my phone to check. Um. Well, I'll... I'll keep it open in another tab, just in case. But, let's get the music back. Come on. Eh. Ooh. Spooked me. Woo. Now that's what I call MIDI. I can open it, but it's extremely resource intensive. Yeah, I just get... <laughs> I just get a hash. I'm like banned. I'm banned from NORAD, guys. Yeah, I just get a hash. I, I, I don't know why. Let's try Edge. Maybe Edge can be useful. For the very first time in human history. Oh my god! Edge saved Christmas! The war on Christmas has been won by Christmas. This is the music that plays when Santa wins. As he reigns over the bodies. Where is he? There we go. That's a better... So he's over the North Atlantic Ocean, which is like... Like, who's getting... Shaving a haircut, two bits. Um, let me open. So this is our list. So cookies. Oh wait, 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 wait! Make, make cookies and feed them to a boonie girl. Woo! Oh, I was gonna give him like fishnets. Uh, that kind of gives the vague impression of fishnets, right? That's good enough. That's good enough. Uh, get the straight piece. <laughs> it looks like he has Bell's palsy. <laughs> um. Um. Let's give it cat ears, too. Yeah, that'll kind of do. These middies are so fucking on point. Eh, get rid of that. Uh, let's do it to it. Wait, what's this? Oh, you can come on him! Good. <laughs> you really can. Uh, sprinkles. <laughs> he looks like a semen crime scene. Oh my god. He's like when they... they you know how they have like a blood splatter experts? This is what a semen matter ex splatter expert sees. I think I like the regular sprinkles. I think that's good enough. And he's fucking been vored. God bless America. <laughs> Uh, let's see here. Christmas booty. Anime Christmas makeover! Now we're talking! Now this comes bladder investigations. Should these not- oh, this one's- this one- oh. Were all of them muted or just this one? 
All right, we might not need. Oh, there's sounds. Gosh. Bonnie games, games, games. There she is. There's Bonnie. Famous video. <laughs> oh my God, the unblink was really creepy there. Merry Christmas. Oh no, this is, this is the, the FPS that plants grave. There's, there's a disgustingly pink mouth right there. That is supple, and I don't like it. This is, and that's just an anus. It's a mis- <laughs> Little rabbit teeth. Uh, hang on, I have to fucking see what's going on with my PC. If something insane is happening, because why are these lagging so bad? I'm gonna check that stupid thing that happened last time. Oh my god, it's going- The, the MIDI's going fucking metal! Holy shit. No, the power level's fine. Huh. Previous In a previous stream where we had issues, the, the power level was at 25%. If NORAD is still open, I don't believe it is. No, I don't have it open. Operator GX called it a greedy tab. That certainly seems apt, yes. Maybe, am I loading this into, let's stop that video and let's pause that one. These fucking Flash games should not be a problem on my system, but you know, Flash, Flash was never known for its performance. Wait, what? Woo! Now the lag is adding to the music. Oh, hang on. What is this doing to my system? 50 per... <laughs> That's a lot of CPU usage. It... What on earth? Do I have like NORAD in like a secret tab? That's like eating my PC? I think it's just the game. Can I like put you on low quality? Oh, I think that helped. Barely. Wow, yeah, there's... <laughs> Ruffle needs some work, I guess. Now that... The, oh, oh, it's one of these where they're, like, separate pieces. I hate that. Like, why would you ever want the colors to be different? Like... <laughs> I, so this is still playing too slow, isn't it? <laughs> Race change makeup. Alright, the, 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 <laughs> the slowdown MIDI is driving me insane. Um... Happy Christmas. Oh, more anime girl. You gotta have... You know, you gotta have that anime. Anime is a very important part of Christmas. Santa's on his way to Canada. Oh, wait, no, this is the exact same one. Um, Line Rider game. Now we're talking! Snow line! Oh my god! Santa's fucking doing lines! Man, so that's how he, he does this stuff so fast. He does coke. Now that's a cokehead Santa if I've ever seen one. Your tidings to you. Oh god. Why is the frame so bad? Why are the frames like this? Hang, hang on. Something has to be wrong. I'm gonna I'm gonna close and reopen um Chrome. Alright. How's this? Okay, it's still bad. Let's put quality low. I swear I've used Ruffle before, and it was not this bad. Especially not on this. Oh, God. Does anyone have non-Flash? Well, let's try it in Firefox, actually. Yeah. Alright, so, yeah, that's... Or Edge, Edge, actually. Let's try Edge. E can Edge save Christmas twice? Oh, that's not what I meant to copy, but... Oh, he's, uh, he's over the North Pole. Oh, no, he's over Greenland. Same thing. Where is it? Oh, he's going to Canada. All right. So, let's do this instead. Oh, hey, shout out to Mini Clip. All right. Will this work? I, if, if Edge works faster than Chrome, 
I will be s s shocked and appalled. Oh, god fucking damn it. Uh... That seems about the same. Oh! Well, it's not too bad. Wait, hang on. Is it muted? Why is it muted by default? That's so weird. Oh! Oh, the frames! Amazing. <laughs> the hat, though. Uh, no, 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 no. No, that's not gonna work. Oh, oh, it's frames! Oh god, Santa! Santa, no! Santa died on the way back to his home planet. Like, genuinely. Hey, hey, have I disabled the hardware rendering or something? System and performance efficiency mode. Hardware acceleration is on. What on earth? No, it's not the full screen either. Well, Santa died, obviously. Uh, weird. Snow line mini. Oh, no, we already did that. Dooly dooly Christmas. Will this work all right? No. No! No, it won't! Okay. Alright, let's open up a Firefox and see if this works better. Just close all of Chrome. Stream suggestion is to continue MTS3 Santa episodes. Oh, all right, that that seems much better. Why is it muted? I regret everything. I regret putting. Uh, no, you know what? Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Now that's graphics. Good god. No wonder this game was loading so slow. Look at these graphics. The concept is nebulous at best. Oh, I gotta put- oh, it's a cleanup. It's a fucking cleanup game. <laughs> Ignore what my mouse is doing. It's fucking- it's, why? Why? Oh god. This is like one step up from like, you know, the Elsa fucking dentist games. Yeah, it just- it starts muted. That's so weird. This is like the world's where in, in a world where people are Neopets, this is what they have for Neopets. This is... These are the human Neopets. Oh my god, that fucking unseeing stare is... terrifying. Imagine having to make these games, like, day in, day out. You just... You make this. Your ears are bleeding. Good! Oh! <laughs> this is saying Satan. Oh, he's got an air fryer. Oh, oh. Why is it crispy? Oh, oh no, it's crispy now. Alright. The, qual the, qual the low quality is not much higher or lower. Alright, I, I, I think I've had enough. Oh, god damn it. I actually didn't mean to close that. Uh. <laughs> I think I've had enough of Dooly Dooly Christmas cleanup. I was literally in the title. I guess I should, like, read things sometimes, but. Not today. That is an air fryer. You're not an air fryer. <laughs> Clearly you don't own an air fryer. Oh, hell yeah! Arm oh, that's an ancient army. 2007! Be the Santa. So, I, I could have swore like a billion years ago, I stopped using Firefox because Flash worked better on Chrome. And now, like, Flash emulated runs terribly in Chrome? Uh, what am I doing? What? <laughs> I'm, I'm feeling the noise meter. Can I sneak? Oh, I'm a colonel. 
<laughs> Johnny, go back to bed. <laughs> Failure. <laughs> this is a sneaky mission. This now this is what Mary Gear Solid should have been. <laughs> I'm so it's it's a really neat game, but like oh my god, that last level what? Oh, am I supposed to like fuck the tree or something? <laughs> Is there any cure to the noise gauge? Or am I just doomed? No, I'm just doomed. Oh, crap, they're after the presents. <laughs> I guess Santa would have to be sneaky. That's why the CIA has an eye on him, obviously. Alright. I hope you enjoy Mr. Mouse, because he he is here. This is one of the rare times you see my full PC experience. The fucking film grain is going to give me an aneurysm. Why is there a film, gr film grain? I hate how you get stuck on corners, but the, the, sound, the sound meter still goes up. Even though you were stuck on a corner. It's not fair. Oh, that's a good sound. <laughs> this is amazing gameplay. This is incredible. Trying to deliver presents. This is the peak of... Uh, what the... <laughs> Alright, I think... I think we get the picture. I get the picture, Mark. Twelve holes of Christmas. There's absolutely no way this lives up to its name. And it's a golf game. <sighs> get your holes ready. It's Christmas, kids. Happy holidays in papyrus font. Ball color. Ice. Cranberry. Well, it's got to be cranberry. Um... Seven characters. Choose from one of our client-themed putters. Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Hooters Restaurants. What? Nelita North America. This is so fucking corporate. This is disgusting. Bad cock first. What? Listen, I don't even need... I, I, I don't even need to read the next ones. Uh, bad cock furniture. Fucking, we're <laughs> twelve holes from Badcock. That's what this game should be called. Bar. <laughs> it's not as good as Putt Party or whatever the um. Did you see the the seamless transition of the JPEGs? Is a this is some serious like one guy in a basement flash game shit. I love that as a text. That's an editable text object. Thank you. Uh, why? <laughs> Look, the sand is like censored. The sand is offensive. All right, go big or go home. Oh, oh. that would have been amazing. We're talking about Santa. I think less about Alex Jones and more Tom Clancy. What? Oh no. Uh oh. What did I do? That was weird. So uh, in my chat thing over here, I like I accidentally clicked this button and oh oh ba 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 ba. <laughs> basically, basically that happens. <laughs> Superman legit for real believes in Santa Claus. That's adorable. Oop. Gamer. Hell yeah, the fucking power of Christmas is filled all 12 of my holes. Oh, that was... <laughs> I just fucking realized I was, I'm going the wrong way. Well. That kind of ruins my epic gamer score, but... Man. I'm never going to 1000 G score this MF. By the way, did you know that Xbox Live is no longer Xbox Live? It's now like Xbox Network with network in lowercase. This hole is mean. Yeah, this fucking this is the worst hole I've ever entered. I can barely fit my putter in it. Three strokes over par. What par four? Bullshit. 
<laughs> the Xbox Live isn't even Xbox Live anymore. But Xbox Network with network in lowercase. <gasps> Gamer! We're back on course, baby. Hell yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? This, those guys are terrifying. Get ourselves some snacks. I'm sorry. I, I don't want to get content ID. Oh, god damn it. I misinterpreted this as like a tube. But no. Oh, it's a loop. Okay. Uh. Shit. <laughs> I I feel like Peter Griffin in the Sand Trap or whatever that was. Why why is it silent now? Fuck <laughs> this fucking whore of a hole. All right, I'm I'm bringing back the um. Uh, no! 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 I hate my life. Oh! <laughs> Seven strokes over par. Thanks. Thanks. I didn't need that ego anyway. Um, we're going to at least get some music. And we're going to turn it down a little bit because it's very midi. <laughs> now that's what water sounds like. That is how water sounds, guys. Oh my, what the fuck? Why am I able to hit it that fast? I'm the fucking Hulk, apparently. How it feels to chew five guns. <laughs> yes. Oh, come on. Oh, the, somebody dropped all of their isosceles sandwiches all over this hole. I sure hope somebody doesn't drop all their isosceles sandwiches. Birdie! All over my hole. What? Oh, it's like a ditch. Gamer! <laughs> what the fuck is this crack nightmare of a tube system? Was Why is this necessary? Oh, no! Yes! Don't tell me you can go back up the hole. Uh, <laughs> I'm shooting it out of the hole. Oh, nice, birdie. Uh, were any of those earlier games worth redoing? Be now that things like actually work properly. <laughs> not, not really, right? There is one. Oh, I thought this was like an incline. Okay. Ah, oh, three over par. Thank you, Sight Dynamics. Treat a friend to do a round of holiday mini golf. Well, I, lo I miss shit like this. Like, come on. Hell yeah, I want to treat a friend to a round of holiday mini golf. All right, let's see what's next. Be the Santa. Uh, uh oh, is this gonna get me content ID'd? Is this even up? Well, no, it's on. This thing, so. Oh, the Sprite Cranberry! Oh my god, the Sprite Cranberry game! Now I know. Winter Blast, okay. Press Z. Oh, that's not Z. You would fail. So I. Adult Swim used to be cool, but. They deleted, like, all of their, um. Christmas or not Christmas? They deleted like all of their Flash stuff off their site after the Flash like end of life thing, which you know you could still make Flash stuff. You could still play Flash stuff. More importantly, um, are the the snowflakes death or good? Yeah, I, I don't appreciate them taking that down. It, obviously, it's up on archive.org here, but still. Hang on. Uh, no. 
Okay. Um, you know what we're gonna do? Itch. We're gonna play the Sprite Cranberry game. This didn't go quite. You know, we'll, we'll play the uh, the Merry. Actually, we'll play Merry Gear Solid as well. But uh, I want to get the Sprite Cranberry. What? Break free from free your device contracts. Why? Why am I getting ads? What is happening? Oh, thank God, a Samsung Galaxy S5. Uh, thank God. Where the hell did that come from? <laughs> um, Sprite. Uh, come on, flowers. What the hell? Mm -hmm. Hello, idea. <laughs> Where is this coming from? Smooth caramel wrapped in Cadbury chocolate. What is happening? Suddenly overflowing with Cadbury caramello. Why am I hearing ads? I must have a phantom browser open or something. Is it Ichio doing this? What? <laughs> My fucking computer is haunted. Yeah, it was Ichio! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Scared the hell out of me. What? What? <laughs> wow. Um, Ichio is like infected me with ads. What the hell? Was I on the wrong page or something? Do they have trailers auto playing or something? Um, search Sprite Cran. Very. Yes, the thirsty. Oh wait. Brown-haired girl. No, that's not... Yes, Sprite Cranberry. Re the thirstiest time of the year. Reimagine. Oh my god, it's the sequel, guys. It's the remaster. It's even better. Santa has an air escort to St. John's, Newfoundland. Delightful. Uh, get I don't... Fuck off. <laughs> I hate when things have desktop notifications. I need to turn that off entirely. All right. Is this a trap? Am I going to raise the volume on my PC? It's going to be insanely loud. It's late. Oh. oh my god. Fanta Orange. Oh, I'm a Fanta boy. Sprite, let's go! Guys, how do I- Oh! No, oh God! I fucking bashed my head in with the door! Oh my God, that's the scariest thing- I What the hell? Oh, the- The, the, the lighting is disturbing! Ooh. Sprite! Let's go. Is there not a single light in this entire disgusting house? What is this, PT? Are you sure? Yes. Oh no! He Sprite Cran buried me! What? But he just like instantly killed me. Me and Christian have something in common. I don't I don't appreciate what's being implied there. Sprite, let's go! There are no good reasons for that to be a thing. Yeah. Oh shit! Oh fuck! Alright, so don't open the door, Fanta. I didn't say anything about Fanta. This guy likes Fanta. Is, am I supposed to be able to sneak? Oh, I have a Fanta for health. You want a Sprite Cranberry? I don't know why this, this this was a much better meme. Oh shit! Oh fuck! Oh god! Is is there even an ending to this? <laughs> why is he like sing talking? I love how he's auto tuned too. Sprite, let's go. Is <laughs> oh shit! No. 
Oh fuck. Here he is. I mean, if he started in here, I'll just hide in here. Everything will be fine. All right, next time we die. Yeah. <laughs> next time we die, I quit because I, I can't stand shit post horror games that are like actually difficult. Uh, you had to knock LeBron down with Fantas. Are you sure that's a thing? I'm pretty sure Fantas are health. Version 0.2.1. Oh god. Well, we got Sprite Cranberried. Menu. Wait, there's a menu? Difficulty. You know what? It's, it's, it's home. <gasps> oh! Locked! Well, screw you! Whatever. <laughs> hmm. Well, let's get to Metal Gear Solid. I hope this is <laughs> a little less frustrating. Mr. YouTube would be mad if I have Sonic go up. This is the best music I've ever heard. Dude, I love do core. That's my favorite. I'm really into do core right now. Oh my god, this one does have um This one does have Saints. Saban. Three years after the Secret Santa incident, we had classified information that a new Santa had taken power. The whole thing was naughty, but our noses had been on the call too long. His solid snake impression got better. Good for him. Alright. We're gonna actually finish this one, because last time I gave up and it was the very last level. And if, if I had known what to do, it would have taken like one second. See, I thought of using... A high D. I thought of using the camera, but I wasn't sure how to get them to look at it, but I had to use the knock, I guess. It's so dramatic. What the hell? So, so like, the children are, like, some kind of terrorist organization, yes? Like, that's, is that, that's what's happening here? Yes. Okay. I mean, I believe you. Oh my god, this is loud again. <laughs> Ghosts of Christmas past. Oh. <laughs> it didn't this even get to move. You read me, Otacon. Loud and clear, Snake. <laughs> the stalking, stalking. Is <laughs> that's, that's an, uh, that's a... Stalking, stalking b between stalking the face and the impression. Your sin was made with synthetic octopus fire. <laughs> <laughs> Shut, <laughs> up. Shut up. Shut up. Yeah, we know you played Metal Gear Solid 4. That was just an ordinary... Right. I didn't plan on relying on this gadget anyway. Well... I'm just happy you managed to get to the sneak point without getting yourself hurt. I'm happy as long as no one gives me any more unwanted gifts. Oh, you mean that thing <laughs> with Naomi? No, I'm talking about Cole. How am I supposed to have a Merry Christmas if that's all I, I get I can't deal with Otacon's days? face. Well, get, Snake, get him off here. It's I, been a while since anyone's had a truly Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> this is such a fucking hallmark shit. The world. <laughs> yes. pretty naughty children. Naughty oh my god, they are. <laughs> They're the fucking terrorists. Selling their services to the highest bidder. Okay, so the last one was Metal Gear Solid 1. This is Metal Gear Solid 4. I'm surprised they didn't go for 2 or 3. Those are much more popular. PNCs in the past three years alone. So it all started three years ago. That's about the time I assassinated Big P... Uh, Saint Nick. That's right. It's likely that Saint Nick's death lies at the root of all of these problems. <laughs> After all, he did play an important role in the SOC system. SOC system? The Spirit of Christmas system. Oh my system. god, A fuck series off. of checks and balances created by the three wise men in order to maintain an equal balance of all right, naughty so where's and nice. Ocelot? And without a Saint Nick to keep the SOC Where's Frosty system Ocelot? Check, there hasn't been an incentive to be nice. That's right, Snake. We've dropped you off at Outer Saving Mall. <laughs> fuck you! Know, you. Fuck you! Let me guess. I'm not just here. <laughs> oh my god! I'm afraid not, Snake. I recently dug up some information on the U.S. government's encrypted security channel about an extremist group that calls themselves the Ghosts of Christmas Past. The information I've uncovered shows that they've got their hands on Santa's hat. What's so dangerous about a hat? And it's not so much the hat itself as it is the belief. Is there two gold it. tablets in it? Santa's hat has 
full control over the SOC system. <laughs> and whoever controls the SOC system has full control over the entire child population of the world. <laughs> what the ghosts the have fuck? threatened to use the hat to create this a is, world This is PNC, real shit. A world this is perpetual <laughs> naughtiness. That's right. The ghosts are demanding the brain. This is no less bullshit. bullshit. If you've never played Metal Gear Solid, gonna do with it. this, this is do not as crazy as the real thing. I'm not even kidding. The entire world's child population has a bargaining chip for something like. Metal Gear. No, Snake. There's absolutely no reason to jump to conclusions. <laughs> All we know is that the ghosts have arranged a meeting with the U.S. president somewhere in that mall. Oh, my Your God. Mission is to find Mr. Out Obama, get down. To put a stop to He's the got the end gun. The meeting takes place. Gotcha. For the duration of this mission, we'll be referring to each other uh, by I'm sorry, I don't names. think What's Snake says gotcha name? like that. What? Old Snake? No. Solid Snake. No one's called you that snake. in years. Yeah, but... Look, I'll let you decide for yourself. Would you rather be called old snake or cold snake Ned. cold <laughs> snake i guess good remember snake wow. the ghosts have santa's hat which means that any children you run into hat. during the mission are under their control <laughs> do whatever it takes to stay out of the enemy's field of vision got it head to the elevator i'll be giving you advice and instructions via codec my frequency is 012.25 good luck like seriously, like <laughs> aside from the Christmas trappings, this is this is basically exactly what happens in this game. This is more or less just what it is. Alright. No use. It's no use! Uh what did I do? Walking. Wait, what? Oh, if I click out, that's actually kind of, wait, what? I don't know why it kept pausing there. That's weird. Oh, I have no idea. Oh, god damn it! One step! It's really... It's really Metal Gear Solid. Oh my god. This <laughs> It's actually genuinely, like, exactly the way a Metal Gear Solid game in 2D would be. Stranger danger. Uh-oh. Shift walking. He feels asleep. <laughs> you can always access me via codec by pressing. <laughs> I, that, that's, I don't need you that, buddy. In a difficult situation, just give me a call. Oh, actually, maybe that would have come in handy last time. Head inside outer safe. like the try and save that kid ahead is guarding that landing pad pretty carefully you should try distracting him by knocking on a nearby wall to do that hug a wall with the shift key and then his press snake the is much better than his uh, Any nearby guards will come investigate the source of the noise you can use this to open up a sneaking path so I press control while hugging a wall to knock on it got it Say, Otacon. Yeah? Knock, knock. Oh, what was that noise? Uh, <laughs> you're supposed to say who's there. It's just my imagination. <laughs> That's good. That's damn good. Damn it! <laughs> oh, hey! Not bad! <laughs> they got the, uh, and <laughs> they didn't do an annoying. Oh no! I'm all the way back! Oh man. <laughs> I feel asleep. Maybe I do need to use the codec. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> these these controls are dumb. I hate the shift and control thing. You gotta love this classic like ocarina of time guard rotation. I love the footsteps on the ice. Beep up, beep up, beep up. All right, what do you, what say you, Otacon? You're on the roof of Outer Savin Mall. Y yeah. Find the entrance to the building in the northeast corner. No way, right? Like, no. Guys, I, I can't do stealth right now. <laughs> oh, okay. Not as bad as I thought. <laughs> His vision's pretty bad. You know what? You know what? Bringing back the middies. Uh, Christmas middies. No, I didn't want to search for Christmas movies. I want Christmas middies. Well, it doesn't matter. Now it has music. I complain about a thing and it instantly stops happening. Classic. Oh, go away, Mr. Mouse. As you can see from the mouse... Oh, wait. You can't see... The wait. As you can see from the mouse, this game is much more normal sized. It's about twice the size of the previous one. The accuracy to Metal Gear Solid is so perfect. Just the moment you think you can play the game, the fucking codec rings. It's based on the same Jolly Ton technology that allows shoppers to easily find the exact Is this necessary, Otacon? The presents they're looking for. But don't be fooled. There's a big difference between the existing Jolly Ton technology and the special Jolly Ton radar you're equipped with. Thanks. Very cool. What's the difference? Well, the subtle swapping of the Y in Jolly Ton to an I in the Jolly Ton radar trickles down to its functionality. Shut up. Whereas the Jolly Ton radar could only detect Christmas presents, the Jolly Ton radar is capable of detecting presents of any kind. Kind. Including human presence. Bingo. <laughs> what? Fuck you. That's right. What about the red ones? <laughs> Those dots I hate represent this game. an enemy's presence. Watch out and stay outside <coughs> of that enemy's field of vision. That's the blue cone, right? Yep. Also, you might have noticed the radar was unusable on the rooftop. Sometimes there's too much interference. In those cases, the Jolaton radar too much will interference. be jammed. Anything I can do about that? Uh, afraid not. Right, so not. you're saying this is a Jolaton radar that you made modifications to? Yep, a specially modified Jolaton radar. <laughs> I would have called it the Autoton radar, but you sure this isn't just my old Soliton radar? Because mailing may. No, no. <laughs> uh, look, Snake, we don't have time for idle chit chat. Oh my God! <laughs> that's the... wow. That's the uh, Metal Gear Solid Five uh, Four like menu sound. Raiders actually like kind of in the way. Now this map would have been a lot nicer in the last game. Wait, well, oh come on, I got stuck in the door frame. Come on. Santa's thick. <laughs> I was it, I was dummy thick. I clapped it right into the door. <laughs> Every Metal Gear Solid has to have the fake um, you got spotted bit too. So again, very accurate. I complained a bit about the last one. These these are really quite faithful in terms of the parody of uh, Metal Gear. It's just, it's just 
little bit tricky on a couple levels. A surveillance case that problem. With the it's door a mall snake. <laughs> right. Remember, these security cameras have a blind spot, so you can sneak beneath them without being seen. Nobody here. As, aside from that, up, pacing is a lot better in this one. It is kind of neat to. That's why I tend to play these things, you know, in order. Yes, and the <laughs> have set up an ambush on the first floor. Oh my God! In case the meeting with the president goes sour. First floor. And where is he? He, our third. What? Are you afraid he'll flake? Shut up! I don't really trust him. But I've got no choice but to believe him for now. Without Shut up. Belief, you never be able to inherit the title of <laughs> Christmas. I suppose you're right. Again, Are this this is no more crazy than any Metal Gear Solid I game. Just need a little time to cool off. You stay the writing quality is exactly on point as well. To arrive. You hear that, Snake? The ghosts are meeting with the president on the first floor of the mall. You'll have to get down there to make sure things don't get hairy. Wow. I, I like to play stuff like this in order, even if the first one is not necessarily the best example, because it's really cool to see developers, you know, learn, oh, so this, I need to do this this way, and, you know, you know, this wasn't as funny as I thought it was, because, you know, all of the, the slow early levels is really what I'm bitching about, but... Otacon. This huh. is really not Looks the time. Like the elevator's down. You'll have to get around the mall by foot. I just... <laughs> I guess everyone's... The... I mean, I am snakes, you know. I step on my toes for, it you know, like Quentin Tarantino reasons, kind of and then... Halloween costume store. Oh my god. Maybe you can find something useful in that Oh my god. Room. That's located in the northeast corner of the store. They <laughs> really do be clingy, though. Oh, he fast! I have no items, do I? Oh wait, Z. Yeah, no, nope. Oh, I can just go on the outside. Alright, move. Alright. Let's get our box. Lucky for you, that guard's asleep. <laughs> Otherwise, he'd definitely come investigate the commotion. You can get past metal floors without making much noise if you slide along the walls beside them. <laughs> slide. You really do mean slide. Alright. D mask. Otacon, I found a reindeer mask. Ah, uh, Snake, is there something you have uh, to, to, to tell me? Aren't you usually the one to tell me how new items work? Well, it's just... Uh, <laughs> I want you to know that Furdom has been around for a long Fur -doms, time. Furdoms, fur subs, Fur-dom. you know. Yeah, you know, furries. It's a, um, it's a fandom that revolves This isn't around unlike something that would be anime. in fucking MGS2. too. with you, isn't it, Otacon? I'm a mercenary. I don't have time for any nerd hobbies. Now tell me how I can use Especially this with the thing. whole accelerated well, aging start, thing. It's frighteningly realistic. Has it got a red light up nose? Nope. Darn. So it's no good as a flashlight either. Let me put this thing on. Maybe it'll give me some ideas. <laughs> Snake? Snake? Where'd you go? It'll give me some ideas. Oh, there you are. Well, I wow. could have sworn you were a mounted deer head. Oh my god. <laughs> <Mounted deer head. laughs> what? You'll be able to avoid being seen. As long as you're hugging a wall with that thing on, oh, that's so just good make and sure useful. not to move, or you'll give yourself away. Also, if you bump into anyone, the jig is up. So stay out So it's like the box, back. but it only works on walls. Uh, huh? huh? What was that? That sleeping guard must have woken up. Snake, you're surrounded. Use the deer head to sneak your way out of there. <laughs> no, that's a sentence. That's a goddamn sentence. All right. Deer mask. Pretty sure do be mountain deers, though. Look away. 
Come on. He's just not gonna look away, is he? I found him. No, what? I must have to make a noise then, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright. Huh? Hey! Alright, easy. Oh, mouse. Sorry, Mr. Mouse. <laughs> the UI is, like, slightly distracting. Oh, I should have gone. Outer Saving. Oop. I like that it, it your body goes away when you're fully invisible. That, that's a really nice like UI touch. And see, they gave more reason to sneak against the walls, like I was bitching about last time. Yep, there's just a deer head on the wall here. That makes complete sense. Uh oh. No, don't touch. No touchy! No touchy, my parole! Oh shit. Shit. Snake! 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 Somehow still getting used to the controls. Uh-oh. Don't. No! Snake, what's going on? My parole has been Snake. violated yet again. Snake. Snake. All right. I think I need to be on this wall, yes. There we go. <laughs> Synchronized sleeping. These guys are gonna have like the worst back pain ever after this. Don't take another step. <laughs> that Unicode is snowman! Also, well ASCII snowman. Electrified. Who are you? Just a voice in your head. But you can call me Cindy Lou Who. Or Who for short. Cindy. A girl. Do I say <laughs> a girl to you? What is your trust the voice over Kodak? I've already been fooled once by my twin brother. <laughs> <That's weird>. <laughs> <You> <laughs> how how did that happen? Disable the high voltage switch. You're using burst transmission. Are you nearby? As for the gas, you don't want to be breathing any of that stuff. It'll knock you out cold. Wait, why is there a room filled with gas next to the floor inside a mall? <laughs> to keep out intruders like you and I. That makes sense. Hmm. Who are you anyway? An old friend. <gasps> Otacon, I need you to run a trace on the frequency of my last codec conversation. What codec conversation? That's right. He was using burst transmission. Burst transmission? Oh, there's no way to find the codec frequency of a conversation. <laughs> Even the techno like babble is pretty except, on point. Except what? Well, have you tried looking on the back of the Blu-ray case? I know, I know. It's a pain. <laughs> but you need to find you. the Blu-ray case for Mary Gear Solid 2. You see the Blu-ray case labeled Mary Gear Solid 2? <laughs> no. Huh? Oh, wait. We're on the PC. <laughs> and the game is downloaded onto your hard drive. <laughs> they do. they no genuinely do this in Metal Gear Solid 3, too. Oh, God. Or 4. Get a grip. What an age we live in, huh, Snake? <laughs> Digital distribution. Wonder what they'll think of next. So, no. No what? You can't run a trace on my last codec conversation? Uh, afraid not. <laughs> the mall 
Apple's central computer and activated the Muzak in the <laughs> Thanks, buddy. It should have woken up those sleeping guys. Muzak. Tactical Muzak deployed. Presente. Snake, that present looks pretty well guarded. Maybe you should come back for it later. Oh, We Metroidvania now? What the hell? Okay. This is really- no, the, the- somebody asked if the last one was Die Hard. No. This is Die Hard. Oh shit, oh fuck. Oh, oh, okay. Never mind, we good, we good. I think- no! No, we not good! We not good! Oh, I should have taken the opportunity. Snake! Snake! Come on. Oh, it's control. We control shift and Z. Like it kind of works, but oh fuck! Snake, what's going on? Die Hard Snake? is Christmas movie. Snake? We we've been over this. Snake? We we watched Die Hard last week actually. I think I think you were there. I you weren't talking to. It was hard to tell, but uh... oh yeah, I haven't mentioned it too much on stream yet. But we we're doing uh, Culture Nights where we we watch some movies that uh, I reference a lot and that people haven't seen or just. Just good movies, really. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Alright, we- NO! Oh, I didn't even see that. But yeah, so in the Discord we have a weekly thing on Wednesdays. Where we watch pro probably a lot of like 80s and 90s movies for now and like... Dumb stuff like the uh, the Super Mario cartoons, we'll probably watch those at some point. I swear, when I start, I like can't cling to the walls for a second. I don't know what it is. Oh. Riff track presents of Die Hard. Snake! Yeah, we started off with Die Hard, because you know Die Hard. Oh, you can see him. You can see him. Just you can see one pixel, which is all you really need. Yeah, we'll probably watch a bunch of meme stuff and oh, oops! I almost made the same damn mistake. All right, we good. We good. <laughs> Again, this is a lot more video game than I was expecting. This one's actually like the last one is like. You know, it was more like ship post levels of like effort. It's like you know, there was there was some mechanics and stuff, but each it was like one level per mechanic, just like a little like you know, just a little peek at things. How is this convincing, by the way? How is that convincing? <laughs> um, but this is kind of a more full fledged thing. You like have to use the wall hug all the time. Oh. Oh. This one must be longer, <laughs> considering it's like an actual game now. All right. across the metal floor. I just realized what my my current quest is. Investigate the ladies' room. Hmm? 
this will work. No! <laughs> no, it won't! Shit! How am I supposed to know which tile he's gonna use? This is this is the worst laid out mall I've ever seen, by the way. Alright. If he takes the left path this time, I'm gonna shit. Alright, we're good. We're good. Investigate the blood trail. What? I just realized I went the wrong way. There was two ways to go at the start. And I just assumed there was only one way. So I didn't look at the map. Oh, god damn it! <laughs> now I made it more difficult on myself. Oh, if you sneak by... Okay, that's not too bad. I was supposed to go this way. <laughs> this radio, this radio interference in the ladies' room. Okay. It's the oh. intruder, Snake. What's going on? This is the biggest Snake? bathroom I've ever seen. Snake? Snake! Yeah. Oh, right. You pressing the damn wrong button for continue. Oh, where is he? Oh my God. Oh my God, is that Johnny? Quote, man. I'm sure that made much more sense to quote at the time. Whoa. What is he, what is he doing? Light speed. All right. Shitty Johnny. Let's go. Wait, what? Cane. Oh my god! Otacon. What the hell am I supposed to do with a candy cane? That's no ordinary candy cane. Read the wrapper. Not this Nova again. Cane. That's right. <laughs> That's a Nova brand candy cane. It's made with an especially strong child quieting corn syrup. Or CQC. Oh my CQC. god. I get to CQC beat the children is an now. It's anesthetic capable of putting a child to sleep. Ever notice how doctors will give a kid a lollipop after a shot? Sure. Those lollipops are laced with a small <laughs> dose of CQC. They're used to numb the pain, and to keep the kids quiet. The dosage of CQC in that Novocaine is much, much higher. Time. So you're telling me I could put a kid to sleep with this thing? <laughs> this is right an like, interesting. And knock him out. The anesthetic will wear off after a couple of seconds, so be sure to be out of the area before the kid wakes up. Got it. One last thing. What is it? Candy canes go in the mouth, <laughs> not through the windpipe. You got that? <sighs> Maybe if you're an idiot. <laughs> ah, yes, anesthetic. E exactly. Where's Johnny? I guess he's in the sh he's in the men's room. I guess. But what if I get? <laughs> Beautiful. I bet he's in here, huh? What? <laughs> what? What are these mysterious alcoves? Oh. Uh oh. I can't. <laughs> I found it. Damn it! <laughs> Fiddling with the controls too much. Snake. Snake. 
Merp, merp, merp. I wonder if I have no long tranquilizer in this one, no long range one. I go to the blood trail. The, the objective almost spoiled me. I bet it's cranberry sauce. That's the sort of crap they do. Oh! Man. Snake! 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 <laughs> Clean coal. Clean burning coal cane. I want to beat the kids, but I should be using the uh -oh. be using the deer mask. All right, I'm gonna exit through here to get the quick save point. Oop. I guess I should be looking at the. Um, at the mini-map more than I am. Okay, so they don't have infinite vision in this one. Good. Why is it? What the? Oh my god, it's a cum trail! <laughs> this fucking busted oh the fattest god. nut! The last time I saw that was... Yep, police knots. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure. Oh, it's right in, it's right in blood. I mean cum. I mean blood. Boss area. Phrase. I wasn't talking about the weather, old man. Who are you? <laughs> As spring gives way to winter, <laughs> so too shall the past give way to the present. <laughs> Shut up. It is a present filled with This is with such a Kojima character, oh my god. For revenge is a glass <laughs> best served cold. Shut up. Milk. That's right, Snake. <laughs> I am the ghost of Christmas oh present, my God. and delivering milk is my <laughs> fortified forte. Like ah, I said, real Kojima character. Taste such smooth. <laughs> such Kojima dialogues. These this is incredible. Short-lived feature. <laughs> this is fucking exactly milk how Kojima would do this. Yet so short-lived was my delivery. The temporary <laughs> joy my milk provided could never. Every fucking villain has to show up. You've never seen them before. They they trauma dump Christmas you their entire tragic past and you fucking murder them. My gifts could only be appreciated in the present. Shut up. Milk would have to be consumed by it. <laughs> My gift was a ticking time bomb. Innocuous <laughs> at one moment. I have nothing to add. This is perfect. For many years, <laughs> I faced intolerance. <laughs> but I've got Fuck no time you. to dwell in the past. Oh my god. Snake, today is your <laughs> And let me make it milky clear. Oh my god. You shall be bested by this battle's end. But that's not clear at all. Oh my fucking god. I can't. <laughs> that was fucking perfect. That was. What do, do I hit him? Wait, oh. Find an elevation to the first floor. <laughs> Surely I'm supposed to be doing something, yes? Is he is he just gonna run out of milk? Is is this a um old man thing? The end. Is this an, the end kind of boss fight? <laughs> just leave the menu open until he dies. Oh shit. Oh my god! 
He got me! He got me! Otacon, he's wearing a fox stilt suit. <laughs> mm, you're right, and it looks like it's been specially modified to keep his body cool. I wonder why that is. Oh, his body needs to be kept cool. But, but I don't have anything that can heat him up. I think this is an act is actually a the an old uh, the old <laughs> I keep calling him old a the end boss fight. Unless I need to ask not a cost of the enemy. His blood is white. <laughs> the last time I've seen that was... That's not white blood, Snake. <gasps> That's milk. <laughs> You'd better be careful, Snake. An enemy that bleeds out milk is sure to have extremely strong bones. Your oh my god. Your ineffective here. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Shut up. Holy shit. This guy... Pokemon Company needs to hire this person as... As a Pokemon namer, because their pun game is absolutely fucking illegal in 50 states. I hope I'm doing this right. I think I gotta like heat him up with my body heat. <laughs> Feel my warmth and overheat your warm, milky substance. Okay, I'm, I'm not fully convinced I'm doing this right. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep calling Otacon. Snake, think! The ghost is made of milk. Milk's gotta have a weakness. Lactose intolerance. No, Snake. <laughs> think, uh, lactose intolerance in reverse. Lactose uh -huh. hatred, er, lactose friendship. Snare lost his wish How did you... <laughs> <laughs> Can't you change your calendar? Like, whoop. You mean like my computer Look, calendar? Snake, we've got to hurry before the situation gets real sour. <laughs> you just have puns for me? I know how to defeat him. But are you sure you want me to, uh, <laughs> spoil it? <laughs> Try setting the clock on your computer ahead a week or two. All right, it really is. All right. Hey, okay. was there like a pause button on this? <laughs> I thought it was just, well, I guess it really is like, uh, the end then. Hang on. Like, I thought it'd just wait a long time, which I think does also work. Uh... No, change time. Um... Set time. No, I don't want to search Google! Change the... God, why is Windows 11 search so bad? Uh, set time automatically. No, set time manually. January. Wow, it's New Year's stream already. January 24th. There. <laughs> now that's what I call a blood curdling scream. Shut up! Not even the refrigeration Fuck you. of your cooling suit could have kept the milk in your veins fresh for that long. <laughs> I see your mental skills haven't thawed a bit, Snake. Well. Just like cold times. Do I know you? <laughs> We're not so different. You and I, the children of a cold generation. Oh, does he scrap to this? Who are you? My father. Maybe I, I might have My seen that. I, it's just been so long I forgot. Wise men. Fortunately, I don't remember any of it because this has been outstanding. He was well on Actually, I think I only saw the first one. inherit the title of Father Christmas. When in a freak accident at San Geronimo, his body literally burned itself up. That special blue fox sneaking suit. You must be Python's kid. Please, Snake. Father had a name. Python was just a code name given to him by Fox. 
fox. Those who truly loved him knew him by his birth name. Frosty Frost. Frosty the snowman. <laughs> that would make you Jack Frost. His Wait, is that real lore? Is Jack Frost Frosty's suit, son? Is that real Christmas the lore? Thing they could recover off of my father's melted remains. Jesus Christ. A cooling suit filled with liquid nitrogen. That explains the sub-zero temperatures of your milk bombs. It was my father's legacy. I feel like it's not really milk if it's frozen. It must be something different at that point, yes? The greatest milkman. <laughs> delivering the coldest, freshest milk in even the hottest of temperatures. However, not even the liquid nitrogen... I've never seen anyone do it to, to, to Kojima as hard as this. This is incredible. The blistering stupidity <laughs> of human ignorance. Human ignorance. Leave it by the door, they'd say. <laughs> as if such a thing were even conceivable. My milk. That which I have literally poured my life into. To sit out in the sun, beads of sweat forming on its glassy container, curdling ever closer to its date of expiration. <laughs> My gift to the world was a gift of the present, a transient gift that could neither be enjoyed in the past nor the like future. genuinely if they're going to do I metal gear solid without kojima which they should do it faster, like hire this guy it hire this guy this I is this is the same thing to Konami. deliver my milk directly into any house <laughs> from anywhere in the world i needed merry gear <laughs> merry gear shut yes. up merry gear a bipedal sleigh with the ability to launch <laughs> location. It was the Jesus Christ men's fail safe. A means to keep Christmas alive should all three of the wise men pass on. But it could only be activated with the entry of three okay, so two more bosses. Codes. This isn't like really long, is it? Because like it took me this long to get to this point. Men. Or is it just like a boss rush? You see, the members of the three wise men were part of an agreement. A pact that bound each of them to enter their secret passcodes on their deathbeds. It was a way <laughs> of ensuring Christmas would go on. A pact that would ensure the activation of the Merry Gear at the right time. My father, Frosty, upheld his part it's kinda of the long. agreement. Um, do you think like an hour or like half hour? I could probably do a half hour. I don't know about an hour. It's kind of stretching it, but it is it is Christmas. Christmas past. Let me look it up on how long to be. Two passwords. We needed just one more. So that's why the ghosts are demanding Nick's brain. Yes, your unexpected assassination of Saint Nick in the secret Santa incident prevented Santa from entering the third and final passcode. We had planned to obtain Saint Nick's brain and extract the final passcode. Two and a half hours total. Access to the Merry Gear. But how would this help? How long have I been playing? Snake. You aren't thinking outside of the box. Or rather... <laughs> How many of the remaining two hours is this exactly cutscene? What you are doing. What do you mean, think, Snake? If the Merry Gear is only capable of launching gift boxes... Oh, not how long I've been streaming total, but I mean this game specifically. Yes, the greatest gift of all! <laughs> <laughs> it's almost over. Oh, okay. It was only my dream. I was wondering either this is a boss rush or I'm going to be here for like two more hours. Place through milk. It seems that this is the most disgusting sound. And I, along with them. But don't cry. <laughs> Why would I cry? I'll be back again someday. Oh my god, she's doing the frosty thing. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> he exploded. I 
guess there's no use crying over spilled milk. Snake, I hate you. Wow. Meow. <laughs> this is fucking disgusting. I can't believe they released this filth. That's guess one next. down, oh. Snake. Just two more to go. If I remember correctly, one of the ghosts is on the first floor. Continue making your way down there. He sounds like a bad Nicolas Cage impression, kind of. Snake, I need you to... I don't care. Wait, what? <laughs> I, for a brief moment, I forgot that I can beat children. That's a damn shame. Naomi's hunting supplies. I don't sleep in. Count ammo 50% off, or camo. Store garden. Powder. Welcome to the revolting Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! Welcome to the revolting Omelette. Exotic survival Six buffies. More than enough to feel anything that moves. Wow. Wow. Why would you have just outer in one room? Like, you can't even see the other part of the name. Oh, sh oh, he hurt. Oh, okay. Snake, snake, snake. Free children. Now that's how you use the quote feature. God damn it. All right. So sometimes beating children isn't the answer. That's surprising. Uh oh. Grass. It's a green Christmas, guys. It actually rained today. That's the kind of Christmas we're gonna have. It's raining tomorrow too. It's a large thermal plastic structure that emulates a natural biome, inspired by the Eden Project in the UK. But architecturally, it's slightly less ugly. It perfectly replicates a subtropical coniferous forest biome, which allows them to grow Christmas trees right inside the moss. Oh my God, that's amazing. Oh, hang on. Get that deer mask on. That <laughs> looks like a vampire eating its own feces. That is also a decent quote. More effort went into the writing of this joke game than the majority of, like... Look away, please. Like, triple A whatevers. Background noise. Hmm. Oh, God damn it. Got him. <laughs> oh. Damn it. I somehow always instantly re-forget the controls of this game. This better be close to the end, because it's getting kind of hard. <laughs> Is that shitty Johnny? Oh, 
Oh, come on. Snake, what's going on? Snake, snake, snake! Please. Uh oh. Oh, come on. Oh man, tell me there's not too many more maps. I'm, I'm just here to enjoy the writing at this point. I guess that's kind of a problem. Oh, fucking hell. I keep doing that! No! Why? 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 Alright, no accidentally bumping against the walls this time. Oh, you bitch. Snake? Snake! Come on. <laughs> no, I was just praising it, but it's just slightly starting to. Oh, god damn it. I keep starting with the wrong item, too, and I'm like, shit. Nintendo 64! Is he shitting? Oh my god, he's shitting. It's shitty Johnny again. Wow, I, I don't want to listen to that. Oh my god, wait, hang on. Killed him! Fuck him! Kill you, motherfucker, bastard. I kill you too. All right. No more that map ever. <laughs> or shitty Johnny. Oh, he's over here. Oh. <laughs> he's seeing me like fucking break his friend's neck. Imagine, like, you're a little kid, and you, like, you race down <laughs> to the Christmas tree, and you see, like, a Santa Claus snapping your brother's neck. And that's fucking hardcore. Oh! <laughs> Saving! Snake, there should be another storage area nearby. Keep your eyes peeled. Be on the lookout for it. Alright, we get a, get a new item. Children's clothing. Oh my god. Le Evans Habilis. Children's clothing. Zone of the Thunders. Uh, no audio gig gag this time. All right, let's see what we got. Oh my god, terrifying. Not a gun. I'm surrounded. Snake, <laughs> please respond. Snake? Snake! Uh, geez, do you do that every time I get caught? Well, yeah. How'd you manage to escape alarm? Turns out these kids are mannequins. Mannequins? Oh, that's right. 
You're in a children's clothing store. <laughs> a lot Still, of these sentences are very alarming. There. Out of context. That's the perfect place to set up an ambush. Uh, if only your radar wasn't jammed, you'd be able to avoid the real guards. Maybe you should try to do something about that and come back later. What? So there are real guards. Well, shit. I'm saying this has to be much longer if there's like two different things that have been like, hey, you should come back later. I've opened up the door to the revolting <laughs> Oh my what god. Floor? You might find something useful in that. to redo all this. Now that's getting a little artificial replayability here. Or not replayability, but you know what I mean. This is supposed to give the vibe of, you know, oh, God damn it. I'm so used to always having the deer mat. Wait, what? Oh, fuck. Honestly, what am I going to do with the rest of this game that's funnier than me wasting those four kids? Alright. Uh... This time. <laughs> no, that is satisfying. That is goddamn uh oh. That is goddamn uh oh. I feel like I should be earning Chivos for how many children I beat. much as I want to kill those kids, you know, they cause some trouble. <laughs> Shut up. What is survival cuisine? You just, like, drink piss and you eat, like, horrible bugs? It should have been the deer. Merp, merp, merp. Yeah, yeah. No, no, this is okay. What's he saying? What? The that's so creepy. I'm wearing headphones, like the, the random kid voice thing is like kind of creepy. Oh fuck! I hate these controls. I always keep pressing the wrong buttons. Well, who got the presents? Tell me in the chat what uh, if you've got done presents already. What everybody get, or what it's, what's everybody getting for other people? If you won't spoil them in this chat. If your G moms watches my streams, which I know she does. What the hell is he saying? It's so unnerving. I think I heard Pokemon. But no! I did it again! Jesus. Okay. Toast! What? 
Ew, moly toast. Oh my yeah. god, what? Moly toast. It looks like it's been sitting here for years. Hmm, a toast of Christmas past. Oh, looks like the you. mold's got a slight glow to it. Must be full of power. <laughs> Shut you're up! You're not considering... I, you're not gonna eat that thing, are you? All this sneaking around's got me awfully hungry. Oh, this can't be safe! Ah, don't worry about it. A bit of strawberry jam just to mask the mold and... Not <laughs> Otacon. What's happening to the jam? Wow, <laughs> it looks like the mold is breaking that jam down. It's almost completely disappeared. Great, so now I've got a jam-eating mold. What use have I got for that? <laughs> well, it's a stretch, but... but Maybe it could break down radar jam too. <laughs> Try Shut taking up. it out in an area Shut where up. the Jolaton Shut up. reads no use. No use. <laughs> That's a stretch even for Gojima. What is the Oh, it's the little podium thing. Welcome to the revolting. I've been meaning, I don't think I mentioned it earlier, but I've been meaning to stream this for. Oh, thank God they removed the guys. It would have been a mean to make me do that three times. Um. Oh shit, what was I talking about? Oh, thank God. I can't believe they, they finally had a little oh, bit of niceness. Well, but yeah, I've been meaning to stream this for years, and I'm so glad Something to finally be doing be it. Going on. Snake, you'd better hurry. Uh oh. So if this is the toast of Christmas past, is there only one more power? Most of the gifts I give these days are Steam gifts, so I just buy them day of, which is, you know, saves me the wrapping and everything. I'm not big on wrapping and all that stuff. I can't wrap for shit, but uh, I usually just do Steam gifts where applicable. Plus, like, you can actually, like, I love just being able to use a wish list, because, like, you don't want to give somebody the wrong thing, but you also don't want to just be like, oh. Uh, what should I get you? So a wish list just takes all of the... Oh shit. The uh, pressure off for that. Creepy as hell. It's Christmas time in Discord. Box and a North American box. Otacon, help! What is it, Snake? It's a trap. I can't see. I can't breathe. And everything smells like cardboard. Wait, Snake, are you inside of a box? <laughs> Snake, you can't go crawling into every cardboard box you see. Not all of them have handholds. I don't need handholds. What I need are air holes. Snake, you do realize that the holes on cardboard boxes are used to make them easier to lift. Don't you? And I suppose the air that flows through those holes is just a convenient side effect. <laughs> or I've been imagining that too. Look, there are some things you can only learn through first-hand sneaking experience. And there are some things you could only learn by clicking through random articles on Sneakypedia. <laughs> Sneakypedia. Well, are you familiar with the idea of Sakoku? I'm not watching no. another one of those again. No, Snake. <laughs> this has nothing to do with my Japanese animes. Sakoku, or locked country, refers to Japan's old foreign relations policy. Under Sokoku, no Japanese were allowed to leave the country. At the same time, no foreigners were allowed into the country. Remarkably, it marked one of the longest periods of peace in Japanese history. Oh, brother. I can see he's been reading a <laughs> sneaky page on Japan again. By sealing yourself in a cardboard box without air holes, you'll be isolating oh yourself God. from the outside. That includes all of the good, but also <laughs> all of the bad. <laughs> I'll still be able to use the box as a stealth device, though, right? That's right. As long as you're standing still, you'll be disguised to look just like an ordinary cardboard box. Be careful, though. Don't let any enemies get too close, or your disguise will be ineffective. Stay out of the enemy's path. Got it. Be careful not to forget to unequip the box when it's not in use. Why? To breathe. Oh, right. <laughs> oh my god, it's a real mechanic. Uh -oh. Yeah, yeah. It looks like you've got company. Uh-oh. Watch out, Snake. 
That's the Tengu Advanced Defense Patrol Operations Lightning Espionage Unit. That's a mouthful. Most people just call them the Tadpoles. <laughs> God. The Tadpoles are a highly specialized PNC group, notorious the for their lightning quick reflexes and unparalleled dexterity. Funny, they look just like little girls to me. <laughs> well, they are little girls. Ballerinas, to be precise. Oh my God. Ever been to a children's ballet recital, Snake? <laughs> that I can remember. What Believe the hell me, is these questions? These kids would give you an unforgettable performance of the Nutcracker, oh my so God. you better not let them get too close. The Tadpoles wear special Tad Pro stealth suits made from a synthetic semi-liquid material called Tad Polyester. That must be what gives them their slimy appearance. <laughs> the Tad Polyester acts as a lubricating agent, eliminating almost all friction between the joints. This allows for total fluidity in motion. The lubrication also prevents anyone from getting a firm grip on its surface. So no CQC? Afraid not. What about distractions? Like a ballet dance, every tadpole's position is choreographed by a central controlling entity called the level designer. These instructions <laughs> are then you. communicated to each individual tadpole via nano machines. Because of the complexity nano and intricacy machines. of these instructions, to miss a mark could spell disaster for the rest of the team. That's why tadpoles are injected with a blocker enzyme that prevents them from straying from the level designer's plan. So distractions are out of the question. I'd say your best bet is to sneak out of there using your cardboard box. Try to anticipate the tadpoles' movements and avoid being caught in their path. With a little Man, luck, geez. you should be able to find a hole in their patrol path and sneak your way out. Good luck. He's gotta be here somewhere! <laughs> now that's what I call voices. Merp, merp, merp. Oh! <laughs> These voices. Nana machine, son. The accent. This is the slowest room clear I've ever seen. Turn away, please. Oh my god, I just realized <laughs> what this is a remix of. That's incredible. Phew! It's no use! Okay, these are the fake ones. He's over here. What? Oh, I bumped into it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm kind of surprised this never got taken down, or maybe it did and I just, you know. No, or no, I, I think it was the official site. Love taking down fan games. All right. <laughs> I'm so glad it only makes you backtrack. Like if you backtrack more than once, it's concerning. <laughs> it's just this dead child oh, in the I'm elevator. There's a sleeping kitten here with a note taped to his back. Now I have What's a it say? Now I have a. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> oh, off. Oh, looks like this elevator is no good either. Shut up. Oh my god, what? What is this? Snake, looks like the box might be useful here. See, now that's how you give hints. That's fucking creepy. Children moving in unison is like highly alarming. Like that never There's happens an in real life. To the first floor just east of here. Keep on heading down that path. All right, I can't breathe. Oh, the breath thing isn't too big of a deal, really, which is nice. Oh, oh shit, he's gonna bump into me. He's over yeah. here. I just need more nano machines. Oh yeah, we should stream um, Metal Gear Rising sometime. That's well, it's shorter than an average Metal Gear game, right? Like, it's... I don't know, regular action game length, maybe 10 hours? We could probably do it in a few streams. Oh, shit. 
Oh, thank goodness. Whew. You get a lot of air in this box. Oh, you got Metal Gear Rising YouTube poops. It's, I mean, it's literally about memes, so makes sense. Dying in this box at all times. Oh. Wait, oh. Now, why doesn't his feet make noises? I'm so glad they nerfed the view distance. Because in the last game, they have, like, real hu view distance. Real human view distance. Um, uh-oh. Uh I might click out of the game. I... <laughs> Take this off, please. Oh, sh- Oh! Should he use the deer mask? This is like a billion- oh, I say as I get caught. This is like a billion times more effective than the box in the regular game. Why, why have remixes of Last Christmas become such a meme in the Discord? Why specifically that? What was that? Wait, what? I mean, what was that? Why did he hear me? Wait, wait, this isn't where I was supposed to go? Or is it? Oh, no, it is. No. Why'd you have to leave it in such a metallically floored area? What's wrong? I thought you might appreciate a little help. You can find something to help you get past that metal floor if you go back to the roof of Outer Saven. What? God damn it. All the way back there. Why didn't you tell me before? I'm a little help. Oh, shut up. Not a big one. <laughs> No, this is just stretching the game. Don't a deer, a female deer. What was that? Oh shoot, he's gonna be looking this way too. Come on, move! I'm, I'm choking, choking on my own rage here. better fast. Oh, sorry, Mr. F I'm not used to streaming that. Wait, can you see Mr. Mouse? Yes, yes, you can. I'm not used to streaming it with the mouse thing on. That shouldn't probably be on. Probably be using the box. Are you sure it's only two and a half hours? I feel like I've been playing it for that long, but I don't know. Maybe it's two and a half hours if you skip all the dialogue, which is like, you know, <laughs> ruining the point of the game, but... Oh shit, oh fuck. Wait, what? Oh shoot. 
And once again, we're the wrong way. I'm also looking forward to the week off. I, I don't know if scheduling live streams for the whole week was a good idea, because, like, you know, it's also my time to chill. But I have wanted to do more live streams, so... If I'm not working, I think a live stream is a lot less of a pain in the butt. <laughs> really is making me go all the way back. Why, why is Femboy Rudolph in the chat? I don't recall that being relevant to anything. I guess female deer, but that's a stretch. At least this area is still cleared out. Is gonna make me go all the way back. I love this like weird, like physically impossible perspective. It's kind of like uh, well, I guess Earthbound has its own different thing. But a lot of NES games had that kind of weird, like Zelda walls. This is, just, this is just padding game length, come on. Don't make me break out the middies. I'll do it. I'll do it. You know what? Christmas song on piano, free midi. No. Christmas. Here we go. Now we're talking. Why is there cum on the floor? Oh, you must have missed the milkman. That was genuinely, you need to watch the Milkman's dialogue. It was actually, like, incredible. Oh, wait, I'm going the wrong way again. Okay, I can't deal with two layers of music. Never mind. Bad idea. Oh, god damn it. I didn't mean to do that. Oh my god. Children. <laughs> Snake was a bit bent up. His anaconda did in fact want some. I, I really have to go the whole way. This, oh, come on. Snake. Does anyone know if this is basically the end? Because it's... I don't want to miss any of the dialogue, but it really used to be getting long. Also, if this game genuinely doesn't have a long play up on... Oh, God damn it! On YouTube, somebody let me know so I can upload my version. I... The way I record, I can remove my voice track, so... But, like, I tried to find a long play, like, no dialogue, you know, no commentary of the first game, and I couldn't find one. But I don't know if that's the case with this one. Because listening to it on mute isn't quite as the same, and listening with, with bleh, listening to it not on mute with two layers of commentary is probably worse. All right, what's this kid's pattern? Oh, so I just have to like kill him. Can do.
I do wish you could just immediately skip through the, um... Continue? Oh, come on. Like, there's this long period here. Well, not that long, but still. Like, I can't just instantly get back in, which sometimes... When you're failing in a stealth game, you kind of need that. My imagination. Oh, come on! I was beating that kid. I'm gonna get a bottle of water here. I really do want to finish this one, but I, I'm starting to remember why I don't really do longer streams anymore. It's just a lot easier to do something, maybe two hours max. Oh, come on. Yep. Snake, what's going on? Snake, <laughs> snake, snake! I love that brief clipping in the snake. This should do. Wait, what? No, go go further down. Don't mind me. All right, this must be. Oh my god! How big is this? Oh, this game is too big. Especially considering the backtracking. Alright, this was the path to the roof, right? I'm like there, probably, yes, please, maybe? Oh my gosh. Oh, fuck. He's over here. <sighs> did, um... Did one of the Metal Gear Solid games I didn't play yet do something like this where you have to replay through like the entire game? Because <laughs> I don't remember doing that in... I definitely don't <laughs> didn't do that in 5 or 4. I mean, you know, in f 4 you do revisit the Metal Gear Solid 1 areas, but... suspect is just they want a longer game. It's no use. I like how my toast can destroy like elevator signal interference. Yeah. And I had to do it in Metal Gear Solid 2 Solid Snake for the MSX. Oh, huh. That might be it. Hey kid, I'm a computer. Stop all the downloading! I, I just love. Speak up, speak up, speak up. Sorry, controls. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm never gonna get used to these controls. Oh, you went back to sleep. Awesome. 
been my imagination. Oh, here we go. A, a, a happy sock? What are you doing with the stocking stocking again? <laughs> what? Is that what this is? This was supposed to help me get past metal floors, but it's all ruined because of the eye holes I made to wear it over my head. <laughs> Wait, you wore the stocking stocking over your head? Well, yeah. I mean, I figured I was supposed to wear it like a balaclava. All you've got now is a pretty holy sock. Yeah, but this was supposed to help me walk over metal floors without making any noise. Surely we could work backwards and figure out how it'd do such a thing. I get it. Like six degrees of separation. Right. So this is a holy sock. What are some other holy things, you know? <laughs> holy rusted metal, Fox Batman! Holes, air holes. Wormholes. Plot holes. <laughs> oh, this is no good. Take a look at your other items. Uh, maybe there's a, a running theme going on. Well, a lot of my items are Christmassy. Great. So, what are some Christmas things that are holy? Well, there's that song. How's it go? Something about a holy night. That's it, Snake. Silent night, holy night. Holy sock, silent sock. <laughs> Brother. What a stretch. As long as you have the holy sock equipped, you'll be able to walk over metal floors without making any noise. Also, the extra traction should let you walk on ice without slipping around. Please tell me the elevator's operational. Oh, oh. Sock. You always gotta have a nice cum sock to equip. Oh, are you kidding me? Uh, what did I do with this one again? The fake alert spooked me and I bumped into him, causing a real alert. Anyway, I'm gonna kill him. I mean, you know, make him go tame. Like an earthbound. <laughs> Is not true that it is wrong to abuse children for fun. Alright, please tell me the elevator, no. What? Oh, find an elevator at the first floor. Oh, no, never mind. We do get an elevator, it's just not this one. Are you kidding me? This is Snake. I'm in front of the disposal facility. <laughs> Excellent, Snake. Age hasn't slowed you down one bit. In fact, it's kept me pretty regular. Oh, my God. oh, oh Snake. You're Jesus disgusting. Christ. Now that's some genuine Kojima shit. Like, unironically. Like, this is the entire premise of Ghost Strand Death Stranding. Sorry if I'm a little late on commentary. I wasn't, I wasn't expecting to go on this long. It's a good game. It's just... I was expecting more shit posts tonight than a good, good game. You know, it's so weird that, like, sometimes you're in the mood for a game, but you're not in the mood for, like, a really good game. Like, you just want to replay something else. Does anyone else get that? Like, I'll get a new game, and I'm, like, I'm not excited enough. Like, I need to... I need to be in the exact perfect mood to fully appreciate this. And so, like, I play something else I've played, like, a billion times. It's, like, it's so dumb, but it happens. It's 
I'm, oh my, oh, come on. I guess that one does have infinite space, vision. Are they making me go through the whole thing like three times now? Come on. Oh, oops, I almost forgot. You found the Hollid Eye. Hollid Eye? It's a special eyepiece that's powered by memories of Christmas's past. <laughs> Snake, can you remember your fondest Christmas memories? Not really. All of my Christmases have been pretty terrible. Last year, all I got was coal. Before that, I accidentally assassinated St. Nick. <laughs> oh, that's right. With St. Nick out of the picture, the Christmas season quickly grew out of favor. Christmas spending stopped almost entirely, which put the global economy in a bit of a bind. Wait, that's what? when two scientists published their work on holistic delusion, or Shut Holodell, up. a way of fooling the mind into seeing an idealized version of the past by filtering out the sad blues and sickly greens of the visual field, <laughs> Compensating with an amplified red component. Rose tinted glasses, huh? Exactly. Shut the up. The Holid Eye is a consumer product using the <laughs> Holidell technology. Great, but how's this gonna help with the mission? Well, Snake, the Holid Eye is powered by Christmas memories, and the compensating effect is much stronger on people with particularly sad Christmas experiences. <laughs> Seeing as you're <laughs> trauma, and let's responsible be for ending Christmas cool. cheer all around the world, well, I'm guessing your Christmas memories are unspeakably haunting, <laughs> soul-crushing even. Well, when you put it that way. In that case, the Holid Eye should overcompensate by amplifying not only red light, but infrared light as well. So I'll be able to see an infrared. That's right. Well, why didn't you just say so in the first place? <laughs> you, know, you know what's happening. Wow. Oh, bitch! I hate that camera. Somebody don't have to get the hollowed eye again. Yeah, I got it. Okay. It was weird because that's the first thing you get normally, but that was good. Oh, damn it! Compilation of me beating children. Now that's a YouTube short. High impact Christmas violence. Okay, VGN, we love you and your yes! Quality old comment. Oh, I mean, at least the revisit is easier every time because of your new gear, but like, still. This is a bit much. Suck. Colonel, why are these socks so crunchy? What? Oh, come on. I have to do... No. I went this way accidentally before. Now I can't remember what... What's the gimmick here? Oh, so I have to wait for both of them to look away? Room. I, I can't believe it's making us go through the whole thing a third time. Come on, man. At least just conveniently teleport me the second time I have to revisit. Man. At least I get to beat children. That's the only thing keeping me going. Also, like, what's the point of this? Is there... I really hope there's not like some secret I missed because I didn't use this on the last two like areas or something. That would be very annoying. Exotic survival cuisine. 
<laughs> it's no use. Yeah, I don't. I don't think it's like that. I don't think you have to use this everywhere. At least I hope you don't. Welcome. To it doesn't really seem like that kind of game, right? about the beating children. Oh my god. At least this part stays empty, but like, why don't the other parts stay empty? Sam is back in Canada. <laughs> Santa, you gotta improve the efficiency. This is why Amazon Prime had to go to two day. Oh, speaking of Amazon Prime, wait, if Santa is real, and then Santa stopped being real, why would people spend less on presents? If, if Santa is the one bringing the presents, there wouldn't be an economic impact. Which is why Santa is, it was real, but was executed by capitalists. We don't have platoon or squadron in Canada. <laughs> I don't know what that means. But I believe you. I do know that milk comes in bags. That's the only important thing that there really is to know about Canada. Oh! Did you see that? It was frame perfect. A war on Christmas. Of course it's a war on Christmas! You better watch out. You better watch out. You better watch out! Oh my god. At least remove the You could have removed- You could have at least added some... Uh, some shortcuts. I mean, there's like gear shortcuts like this, like that was slightly easier, but you know, like, yeah, you get the picture, but still, it's a little bit frustrating. Wait, what? Just, just because, just for the Christmas cheer. Oh my god, a functional airport! Or airport. Um, Snake, I got a gun. The polar gun. The polar a functional gun is elevator. an experimental weapon developed by the U.S. government. It was originally intended for use by the Polar Berets, a <laughs> top-secret special ops group that carried out missions in the Antarctic. It fires a small syringe filled with a powerful polarizing serum that gives its target incredible polar bear powers. What? Now that's what I'm talking about. The initial test showed remarkable results. In fact, the U.S. government was so pleased with its findings that it deployed the polar gun for use in its ill-fated Operation Intrude N90. Operation Intrude N90? Was well, have heard of it. Of course you haven't. Operation Intrude N90 was the government's first attempt to infiltrate <laughs> Santa's workshop in the North Pole. They were after his naughty and nice list, as it contained <laughs> invaluable information Shut about the fuck everyone up. in the world. Information that could help profile suspected terrorists. Wow. The polar berets were to parachute onto the North Pole and immediately inject themselves with the polar gun in order to survive out in the harsh climate. There was just one problem. What was that? It was winter. Well, of course it was winter. When else would they be able to find Santa Claus? Snake, do you have any idea what polar bears do during the winter? They hibernate, don't they? Exactly. Each and every one of the polar berets followed their orders and injected themselves with the serum. Within seconds, each and every one of them fell into a deep sleep. The mission was a resounding failure. So what you're saying is that I could use this polarizing I, I serum as a tranquilizer. <laughs> yeah. yeah. 
Aim the polar gun by wow. holding down the control button. When you let go of control, you'll fire a syringe in the direction you're facing. This, the polar these genuinely gun can are Kojima to your reaches. It's great. But you can reload it by touching floating ammo boxes. <laughs> Course. Just don't ask me where those ammo boxes suddenly came from. <laughs> how they're floating. There's probably a great deal of science behind it. I'm guessing something to do with nanomachines. <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. Nanomachines. All right, we can shoot children now. Wait, why did he fall over? Get fucked. <laughs> Best game. Oh shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's gonna maul people come spring. Eh, don't worry about it. This <laughs> is just gun ammo on the floor. <laughs> Had to be sure, you know? Oh, fuck. Oh, I missed him. Shoot everyone. Oh, sh didn't see the kid at the bottom. Oh, come on. I pressed the button. I think you missed part of that quote. I think that's, I'm Dr. Robotnik. I touch what I want. Sonic. Those guys just stand there all day. Wait. Wait, I'm in the wrong spot. Shit. They do look a bit like Kevin. Alright. Break the children's neck. Wait a minute. I thought this was like murder death floor. Yes. Yes, it is murder death floor. Wait, wait, wait. What am I missing here? Oh, maybe the infrared thingy. I guess I can call it the Kodak, huh? Snake, I forgot to mention that I noticed you sound a bit, uh, different. More like you did when I first met you. You sound a lot healthier than you did in MGS4. <laughs> uh, I mean, in the Middle East. Yeah, the Middle East is a dusty place. <laughs> it really does a number on your vocal cords. Whatever you say, Snake. That didn't help at all. Snake. 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 Oh yeah, we never have we ever watched that Moonbase Alpha video on stream? I don't think we have. Alright, am I missing? Oh, shit. Can you sneak maybe you can move around that the top of that bookcase. Snake! Snake! 
<laughs> he also smokes cigars that literally make you age faster. No, that was, um... That's Punish Snake. Or no, Venom Snake, excuse me. Oh wait, no, Venom... Uh, Punish and Venom Snake are the same person, aren't they? Listen, it's all... Yeah, it's all... <laughs> it doesn't matter. It's... Oh, okay. Oh, shit. What was that? Oh, come on. I just, I was turning to him. <sighs> this man has a lot of snakes. Well, there's only this solid snake, this old snake, which are the same snake, but they, you know, this venom and punish snake, which is also, you know, kind of the same snake. This naked snake, for some reason. For reasons we do not fully understand. Ah! I should have done the knock. Oh wait, no, I can't do the knock. I think. That guy's right next to me. No, I think. I think. May as well beat this child. But no, no. Oh. oh, come on. Snake, what's going on? Snake, Snake. Lieutenant Solid Snake, like Solid Snake is his legal name. Better be getting close. All right, son. Hayarolach <laughs> Nachanami. Yeah. I'm not gonna bother looking that up, but that just seems like something that Kojima would do. <laughs> no scoped. Or no, that's just the, the NES game, isn't it? Snake's Revenge. What a title for a game, considering the themes of all of the Metal Gear Solid games. Oh, because you had no... <laughs> Shit was weird in the 80s and 90s, like the... That Street Fighter PC game, like they made like their they made their own Street Fighter 2 for PC, and it was like terrible or like they tried to and like they made their own game and it was like awful. There was some something like that. It was like a studio made an official port, Human Killing Machine. Yeah, they they like lost the license and they had to like rename it. Oh, fuck. You fight a dog and a bull, yeah. This is one hell of a mall. Paul Blart must work here. I shouldn't have to work within these weirdo doors that I don't fit through sometimes. I wish I could just shoot over the box. Alright. Right, use the right buttons. What 
finally an elevator, good lord. Uh, this elevator oh, come on! Oh, I'm all out of ideas, Snake. He's over here! Snake, what's going on? Snake. Oh, yeah! Snake! Snake. That, was, that was the weird as hell mechanic. It's a lot of weird bullshit, like... They're not even ports, it's just... They don't- you don't really see that ever anymore. Oh, God damn it. Um... But in, like, the 80s and 90s... They would, like... They would call a game the same name, but it would just be a completely different game. Kinda like Sonic 1 on... Uh, actually, even more so, but like, for example, Sonic 1 on... Um... Game Gear and Master System. Is not really Sonic 1. It's like its own thing. And that was by Sega, I believe. I mean, unless they contracted it out, but I don't think that was much of a thing then. But yeah. <laughs> That's alarming. Missile! <laughs> Amidst Snake, mistletoe. Looks like you found the Nikita oh. missile launcher. The what? Nikita fires a missile that can be controlled via remote control. What? Don't you find it a bit weird that there would be a missile launcher just lying around in the middle of a shopping mall the night before Christmas? <laughs> hmm, yeah, you've got a point. Really Tell you what, let's call it a, a mistletoe launcher. Mistletoe launcher? Yeah, it's just like the Nikita, but it fires... Hmm, let's see. Let's say it fires a missile with a pair of lips on it. Oh my a god, kissel. no. Oh, you can't just... That's right. No. And smooching a kid with the kissel <gasps> will overwhelm them. No. With love. Aim the mistletoe launcher by holding down the control button. When you let go of control, you'll fire a kissel, <laughs> which you can then control with your arrow keys. Kissels? Mistletoe launcher? This is ridiculous. Why should I believe a single thing you've said? Well, because if you don't, you'll end up blowing up a lot of- Alright, alright, I believe you. One last thing. The mistletoe launcher can only hold one kissel at a time. So once you fire it, you'll have to find more kissels around the mall. With that mistletoe launcher, you should be able to destroy the electrical switchboard. It's in that room filled with gas. By destroying an electrical switchboard, you deactivate all the electrical floors in that area. You should head back up to the 20th floor. From there, you can access an elevator that'll take you down to the 10th floor. What's on the 10th floor? An elevator you can take all the way down to the 1st floor. Oh. Thank God. And that's where the end of the game is, yes? Alright, well, let's try this thing out. Oh, wow, it moves pretty fast. Wow. It goes upstairs! <laughs> Listen, that kid has been grievously wounded. You don't, don't give me shit about kisses. Anyway, let me read chat for a second. I mean, the game Castle Infinity had a weapon called Mistletoe. It was a missile shaped like a toe. It farted when you fired it, and it was the only way to kill the final boss. Good shit. Oh my god, it doesn't refill! It doesn't refill when you change screens. Oh my god. And we're, we're back to backtracking, but that's... That's just expected at this point, isn't it? There's no way this has been only a couple hours. Alright. You, I'm just going to shoot. I like how they don't really turn into polar bears, they just fall over. You're definitely not killing these children. I feel like we've gotten far enough, we just have to finish it. <laughs> just, I just wish I was at least playing new levels. I wonder if this ref refreshes my missiles. It, it sure doesn't. Okay. Does the 
that. Oh, it does. I'm just gonna see how much longer this is. So. Very. No, I meant Merry Gear, not Metal Gear, Google. <sighs> the official ROM hack database, what? Wait, what? Oh, no, this is the first game. Um, I'm... Come on. Surely somebody has, like, a full playthrough. Um, very years. Oh, fucking hell. I hate when you you think you're type you're clicked into a search box and you're not. Mary Gears, oh my god, it's a full playthrough. Oh, that's a Disease Crabs playthrough. Um, I want like, oh, here we go. This one's three hours. Alright, I'm just gonna hope that I'm here. Am I here? No. Oh my god. Am I here? Uh... I think we're around here. Uh, half what would an you hour. like as content? Thanks. What What do you guys think, man? I just I, I think it would have been almost the perfect length if it got rid of all of the backtracking, or if it just had one backtracking segment instead of like eighteen. You sure it isn't because you quit? Quit what? Well, you know, these things will kill you. <laughs> well, what I'm trying to say is that maybe your voice is returning to normal because you've stopped smoking. <laughs> oh, God, Con. We all know the only side effects of smoking are the ability to see infrared lasers and the <laughs> drain of health. Nothing permanent or irreversible, so long as you've got a few rations handy. But Snake, the Surgeon General... And how else was I supposed <laughs> to know which way the wind was blowing atop that building in Zanzibar land? What? Oh, <laughs> forget I asked. He's over here! Snake? Snake! There's, there's been at least like an hour of backtracking, so like I think we would have been done and it would have been like just about right. Lengthwise. Wait, only one went? What was that? He's over here. <sighs> now this one's making me go through this. This one's worse this way. That's how you solve puzzles. You find every... You just find every child in the room and you shoot them. That's all you do? I'm, I'm really I'm really channeling my Anakin Skywalker. Oh, fuck off. I didn't mean to call you. Say, Otacon. You... I'm sure there's lots of, like, weird and funny... Oh, goddammit. 
things, but I'm, I'm... Snake, do you know what it means to break the... <laughs> Shut up. Um... Oh! Man! What is this? Oh, the tree is in the way! I was just praising this earlier for all oh, they really solved, smoothed over all the problems of the first game, but there's. Oh, God damn it. For one thing, the controls. No. <laughs> He's just like, hey, shut the fuck up. Go away. Otacon's tired of my shit. Absolutely blow the child away. Fuck. <laughs> I keep my hand is slightly aligned wrong. There we go. Please no. You're kidding me! Snake, what's going on? Snake? Snake? Snake! Child. Oh, this, this, this is too much. This game has too much game in it. It's good game, but it's it's going to be samey game. But oh, I just feel it would feel so wrong to not finish it though. Us girls gotta show them how to eat. Yeah, it's a very sunk cost fallacy. Haha, fallacy. I feel like this is something a lot of parody games kind of suffer with. It's like, struggle with rather. You need a pretty specific joke to gameplay ratio. Play <laughs> step tap killing children. That's very relevant, yes. This is like the fifth time I've been in this fucking room. Oh god. I don't think so they don't think they ever made a three. I guess without doing like 3D or something, the idea kind of reached its peak here, probably. Oh wait, I'm going the wrong way again. Man. <laughs> you switch to a real game like Find Marker Player or Kill Bart. Shouts to Kill Bart. I don't agree with the Selma killing policy. This, this, I've been through this a lot too. I genuinely think this is the fourth time. Oh god, I'm so glad it didn't kill me. Like, Metal Gear games really don't tend to have a lot of backtracking. So you get lost. At least none of the ones I played, I don't know. 
I guess technically Metal Gear Solid 5, but that I don't think that exists yet. Ooh, risky. See what more areas should do with this area. This area removes its enemies. Some of the other ones should too, really. Why is it that one flash again that only had one level? Oh yeah. Did I did I do a video of that? So I think this this is the only level. This is the only level two. around in my death box. You know, I kept Parker away from the kittens all day today because he was pretty upset yesterday and he didn't he didn't even care. He didn't even let me um, give him the steroids. He just ran. He hid under the bed thing. I think he saw me. He saw me too early so he was expecting it. The worst part is since there really hasn't been too much amazing dialogue since, or much dialogue at all, really, since the um, the Milkman. Like the Milkman was half the game, like quality-wise, so far. That was incredible. I like that they gradually, like, lose the conceit of, like, haha, no, it is fun. Silly things. And, like, yeah, it's just a missile or no, haha. Um. Magic. What? Snake? I still have the Bad Snake! Monday theme stuck in my head. Uh, the Milkman was, like, uh, very, very good. The game just should have been lost quotes. <laughs> you. Just because. Oh my god. We were here like two hours ago. You should be able to destroy the electrical switch. And then I have to go all the way back again. Room filled with gas. This I'm in that room, idiot. You're kidding me. Oh no. It's not quite as bad as the shine spark from maze, but oh come on. This thing moves a little bit too fast for this, don't you think? Can I slow it down, maybe? No. Oh, slut. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I'm not a big fan. It's like, I'll usually 100% everything except for, oh, a couple of Shine Spark puzzles. It's just like one input too many. It's like it's just a little bit too fiddly for my brain. It's like, no, I don't want to do this. And the, the Metroid developers, they love Shine Spark puzzles. They fucking love just some incredibly difficult shit. Like, that stuff convinced my coworker. It was Metroid Dread. He finally got. I'm so proud of him. He finally got a Switch, and like, he wanted to play New Zelda and Metroid after. Like, his last console was PS1. Um. And I think he had a Wii too, but like he, like he didn't even have an N64. So he's like finally back in the gaming fold. And yeah, the thank God, the um, the Shine Spark puzzles taught him. Oh, I'm not gonna 100% this game that way. Don't forget about the gas. What do I do about that? Just don't breathe it. Oh, I get it. Ha 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 ha. That's that's pretty good game design, honestly. That's like clever double use. 
Also, we're pretending that, like, the children are not being killed. Yet yeah, that electric thing fucking exploded from the missile, so... I'm pretty sure we're just obliterating these children. This is a public service announcement to Channel 5. All the children are fucking dead. The baby fucking dies. Please tell me this is the last part. Alright, stop bitching. It's, it's, according to the thing I found, it's like half an hour. And, and the entire half hour is apparently going to be in this elevator. God damn it. God damn it. Well, if you need to take a break, if you need to get a drink, now's the time. I'm still with a dream. Cake eater. Did anyone watch Joel's uh, Doombot contest thing? There was <laughs> there was a map that did this bit with an elevator, no less. Um, and Joel actually fell down the elevator shaft and had to listen to all of Snake Eater again. <laughs> it's so good. The elevator to the first floor should be nearby. Did, has anyone calculated? I'm sure someone has, but has anyone calculated, oh god, uh, how long that ladder was? <laughs> Get fucked again. He did sock moment, uh oh. Someone did count it was over 400 feet. Watch it, Snake. There's a tadpole oh, God damn, up ahead. Again. I know. I remember. You haven't encountered the ghost of Christmas past, have you? The second ghost? Yes. I can't say I have. I see. Is this last Christmas? I, I, I'm not sure I've actually heard that track. Boxes. This must be the elevator that takes me to the first floor. Remember, Finally. we overheard the ghost of Christmas present say that there's a tadpole ambush up ahead. So you'll have to be extra careful. I've done all right so far. Just remember, they can't be distracted by normal means. Got it. I'm pressing the button. <laughs> 412 the feet now. or two and a half Godzillas. Weight limit exceeded. Ah, uh, Snake, you haven't gained a considerable amount of weight during the mission, have you? <laughs> Are you me? There wasn't a ration in sight. Is there anyone else around? There's no one else oh, here. Huh? What is it, Snake? <laughs> Just a box. <laughs> <laughs> I'm seeing things. <laughs> uh, that box have started to move. Have. 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 What's going on? Oh shit! Snake? Oh fuck! Snake! Maybe CBT. Oh god, this better oh, not god. be the microwave Snake. torture thing. Snake. I can't do that. Ah, oh, you're all right. Sort of. Could use that damn stalking stalking now, that's for sure. What are you... Oh, Snake? What happened to all of your clothes? <sighs> I don't know. I just oh no, it's Metal Gear Solid 2. Oh, good. 
I don't hear any music. You must not be in the mall anymore. <laughs> An awful lot's happened in the hours you've been blacked out, Snake. Somewhat conveniently, too, considering this game's zero dollar budget and its three month development time. <laughs> For a start, the president arrived at Outer Saban Mall, but the ghosts were nowhere to be found. No ghosts. Right. Your mission now is to find your clothes and find out where the ghosts have gone. In that order, Snake. <laughs> Amazing. Look, take... I finally made a meme page on my um, stream deck, by the way. Oh, I can warp reality around me with my nudity. Delightful. Oh, hey, it's the first game! Now that I think about it, Otacon, this place looks familiar. We're back to MGS4 mm. bits. Alright, we gotta be getting close to the end at this point. It's a good game. I shouldn't be bitching quite so much, but the... <laughs> There were like three retracks too many. <gasps> Following in his footsteps. So, who? How'd you find me here? Call it a hunch. get past the infrared sensors. This must be 14015 Hideo Drive. <laughs> Where you assassinated Saint Nick. Wait, don't take another step. You're gonna set off an alarm. Who are you? Call me Santa's little helper. I haven't needed the infrared thing once. Not a big one. Is there some secret I'm yeah. supposed to find with that? Oops. This is God of God's sick of my shit. Come on. Oh, right, I don't have an inventory. Not even the old prison pocket. It only makes sense that an old geezer like the Ghost of Christmas Present would have. How am I supposed to memorize this? <laughs> I'm just leaving, I guess. I found my sneaking suit, but I've lost the Santa Claus camo. Don't worry about it, Snake. With the network adapter, you can just download another copy of the Santa Claus camo onto your copy <laughs> of Metal Gear Solid 3. But Metal Gear Solid 3 is about Naked Snake, not me. Well, you were a naked snake until a few minutes ago. Good point. Thanks, Otacon. You really know how to cheer me up. That's what I'm here for, Snake. Now go complete the mission. Yeah, see ya. Boy, I hope he doesn't find out the special camouflage feature's been down since 2008. <laughs> Dramatic Christmas remixes are great. No, I didn't mean to do that. I like how even when it's silent, the thing still goes. Well, if we're just going through the house and then it's the end, um, there was only there was like ten floors. This, by the way, is why I like to know the exact length of things before I do streams. It was, it's my fault, or I was the one who included this without checking out the link, but, uh... You know, sometimes I'm like, oh, I should quit, and it's like, oh, I quit right before the final boss? Or I'm like, just 
I should have quit like Look 10 hours ago. It looks like Mary what? Gear. Oh my Don't God. worry, Snake. According to the Ghost of Christmas Present, the Mary Gear can't be activated without the three passcodes. As long as we can destroy it before the ghosts get their hand on the passcode encoded in Saint Nick's brain. That thing is just an oversized anime mech figurine. Otacon, who's that sitting on top of it? Oh, it looks like a post. Oh man. no! Special delivery, Snake. <laughs> Sniper. Watch it, Snake. He's gone postal. <laughs> oh, fuck you! Oh my god. And let me assure you, the best is yet to come. Is that some sort of reference? Yeah, that guy could really work on his delivery. <laughs> I am the angel of death, the grim reaper, and rain or shine, I'll never fail to deliver. The ghost of Christmas present, <laughs> and the ghost of Christmas past. In death, you achieve more than you could ever achieve in life. Ghost of Christmas past? I don't remember defeating him. <laughs> we three, the sons of the three wise men. Yet only one could be rightful inheritor of the title of Father Christmas. The ghost of Christmas present, the son of Frosty Frost, Jack Frost. A milk glugging buffoon to bring happiness to the world in the form of milk. As if such a thing was even possible. <laughs> this is real. This is the real Metal Gear speech. Code, he was of little further use to me. And the ghost of Christmas past. Ah, the son of Saint Nick. The son of Saint Nick. Raised by his foster parents to deny the existence of his very own father. The fool knew nothing of Saint Nick, and even less of his passcode. <laughs> I had no use for such a compatriot. So that's right, Snake. Are you aware of the Santa Claus? Oh, shut the fuck up. Yes, the Santa Claus. It is a rule. A curse of the Saint Nick line when all belief in I've been Nick exposed lost, to more punts in the last two hours than I have in the rest of my life. From existence. It was all just a matter of convincing myself that Nick Jr. was nothing more than a child's fantasy. So you backstabbed your comrades in order to inherit the title of Father Christmas. Ha! I, the son of the little drummer boy, <laughs> deserve the title most of all. Drummer boy. And anyways, the past and the present, what purpose do they serve than to pave the road for the future? But you still haven't figured out the last passcode. No, not yet. But now that I've got you here, it's only a matter of time. A postman I may be, but it is you who has made the delivery this time, Snake. And I'll gladly pay the shipping and handling in bullets. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Am I supposed to be doing something? Can I just leave? <laughs> no, I can't just leave. Um, any tips, other It seems like all of the ghosts are delivery men of some kind. And disgruntled ones at that. Maybe there's some way you can use his occupation against him. Kind of like you did with the milkman. Oh, but I'm a box! You're supposed to deliver me, you slut! Hmm, seems impossible for you to get anywhere near him. Maybe there's some way of getting him to come to oh. you. Oh! The mailbox. Oh, god damn it. No, 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 I figured well, it out. Shut up. I kinda noticed. Well, he seems to be aiming at your feet and not your head. Seems like he doesn't necessarily want you dead. Oh. Oh, wait, no. no, no, no. I gotta flip the mail thing up first.
I thought for sure I would like flip up the thing. Any more tips, Otacon? What the hell? This ghost is a postman. I was thinking, could he perhaps have a thing against digital distribution? Digital distribution? Yeah, the transfer of information across digital channels, like the internet. It only makes sense that an old geezer like the ghost of Christmas yet to come would have a problem against a technology that's quickly making his own work irrelevant. What? Mm, you're right. After all, this entire mission was transferred over the internet. The internet's bound to be able to transfer other things as well. It would make sense. Snake, try checking this game's directory for some kind of package to drag and drop onto the game window. Window? Oh, okay. Directory? How drag is that using drop. the internet? What the hell are you talking about? Jeez, what? You never heard of a computer? Get with the times, granddad. Alright, this is a package.zip in the directory. You found the PSG! Finally! Give me something to shoot! Ah, uh, <laughs> sorry, Snake. PSG stands for Package of Sleep Grenades. <laughs> the PSG contains one remote detonated grenade that emits a sleeping gas. Maybe you could use it against the ghost of Christmas yet to come. There's no way I'll be able to throw a grenade that far. Hmm. I had to grab a zip from the game's files and drag it onto the thing. Kind of like the, uh... It seems like all of the Looks ghosts like are delivering him of some kind. Indescribable thing. ones at that. Maybe there's some way you can use his occupation against him. Kind of like you did with the milkman. Package of oh, it's like a pa oh, it's a package. Rain or shine! Here he comes! Is he in a wheelchair? Now, special delivery! <laughs> Freeze! It's been a long time, Snake. Huh? It's all thanks to you, Snake, oh, that I, Timothy Cratchit, will become the next Father Christmas. Timothy Cratchit? You mean your Tiny Tim, Saint Nick CEO, and Operation Secret Santa? Ha! They stopped calling me that years ago. <laughs> after my father, Bob Cratchit, died of asphyxiation whilst lodged in a chimney. <laughs> Do you know what he was doing, Snake? He was pretending to be Santa Claus for his oh my God. children. Oh, how ironic it was <laughs> that it was the Christmas spirit that stopped the rhythm of Bobby, the little drummer boy Cratchit's heart. Then, of course, the media got <laughs> the, the media started calling me Tragic Tim. Tragic Tim. <laughs> That's right, Snake. Born an invalid, but to die the king of Christmas time. All I need from you, Snake, and we can do this the easy way or the hard way, is Santa's way. passcode. But I don't know Santa's passcode. I thought this was why you were going to bargain with the president in the first place. Ha! And risk getting the U.S. military involved? I think not. When I learned that Jack Frost had been defeated, I wondered to myself, could this be the legendary Solid Snake? Trying to throw another wrench into my grand plan? Another wrench? Ha! You still don't know, do you? Three years ago, I sent Saint Nick on a mission called Operation Secret. Oh my God, he's skull face. A mission to a certain 14015 Hideo Drive to deliver a Christmas gift to the 10th floor. I constructed that house, Snake. Impossible. <laughs> Perhaps you didn't notice the outright lack of windows on the inside, <laughs> in spite of them being on the outside. Or the sheer number of infrared <laughs> sensors, much more than would be necessary in any household. Or perhaps the fireplaces without log racks didn't give away that they were, in fact, false fireplaces. It was a I trap have... snake. A prison well, I have now false fireplaces. Nick, torturing him until he revealed his I had to seal up the chimneys to keep get, not getting I bats. Ran into an unforeseeable inconvenience. Unforeseeable inconvenience? <laughs> <You> <laughs> 
<laughs> half of Snake's dialogue is just like repeating Santa. what they just Had said. Had it not been for your assassination of Saint Nick, Operation Secret Santa would have been a success. And I would have become Father Christmas. Then, of course, the U.S. government took possession <laughs> of Nick's body in order to cover up the death of <laughs> It was by chance alone that they left behind wow. I was left with no choice but to come up with another plan. A plan to negotiate for Nick's brain to uncover the passcode stored deep within. To do that, I needed access to the SOC system. And for that, I needed to get in touch with the children of the three wise men. The ghost of Christmas past. That's right. You see, Santa's hat could only be used by Nick Jr., Santa's son. Under the pretense of activating Merry Gear for mutual gain, I created the Ghosts of Christmas Past. Little did they know that the Merry Gear was not actually a bipedal sleigh with the ability <gasps> of launching gifts from any location. It wasn't. Of course not. What use would that be to anyone? No. The Merry oh my God! A VR training simulation course. Designed to transform Colonel, I've squeezed my hog over 500 times in VR. Santa Claus. But why would you want to do that? To bring an end to the tragedy of Christmas. Tragedy of Christmas? It was only <laughs> yeah. by becoming Father Christmas just said. that I could ensure the children of the three wise men would never become it. By becoming Father Christmas, I could end Christmas once and for all. The world without Christmas. What kind of world is that to live in? <laughs> Snake, that's not something you'll ever have to worry about. <gasps> now tell me, Snake. Tell me or I'll extract it from your brain. His passcode. I don't know Santa's code. What were Saint Nick's final words? Uh, Santa's last words were... Yes, out with it. Happy Christmas to all. And to all... A good night. <laughs> Oh, was that the end? It sounds like credits music. Yep. Alright, that was a lot better than the first game. Um, obviously, I had some complaints about the replay. That was really good. And I think that's Cold Snake. Oh, that'll definitely be enough for Grimbo Eve. Oh, my bones. If I just stream for two hours, I don't get too stiff. But four hours. It's a lot of hours. I'm sorry, but he killed himself to avoid giving the passcode. No, he was delivering the, like, sleep bombs, I think. I don't know. I think it was the sleep bombs. The three wise men are the nerve mainframes. Oh my god, you're right. They're the, um, <laughs> the sons of the Patriots. Or guns, or the, wh whatever they were. Terrifying passcodes. Frosty Frost. Don't cry. I'll be back again someday. Entered by Jack Frost. Bob Cratchit. God bless us, everyone. Entered by Timothy Cratchit. Saint Nick. Happy Christmas to all. And to all. A good night. Entered by Dave Black. <gasps> Very dear activated. Please enter the VR chamber. Hmm. Snake? You're not really thinking. Oh my god, Otacon. It's gone there full circle! Things left for an old man like me. <laughs> but to bring joy and happiness to the ends of the earth. There's nothing I'd like more. <laughs> well, if that's how you feel, I won't stop you from stepping into the merry gear. It's been a real pleasure working with you, Otacon. I want you to know that you'll always be a friend, even after I've become Santa Claus. You'll always be a good friend, too, Snake. <laughs> that's a hell of a sentence. Well, guess I'll be seeing you next Christmas then, huh, Snake? <laughs> Not if I'm doing my job correctly. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Otacon. Merry Christmas, Snake. Huh? <gasps> Cindy Lou Who? I can't 
not let you step into that machine, Snake. For the position of Santa Claus has already been filled. <gasps> See, Nick, but I shot you in the head. <laughs> and I'm not too pleased about that. But the true spirit of Christmas lies not within the head, but the heart. Oh my god. I anticipated Tragic Tim's plans from the start. How'd you do that? Why, my list of naughty and nice, of course. <laughs> Once I discovered his intentions, I knew I had to stop him before he could fully act on his impulses. So I planted some information on in the U.S. government's encrypted security channel, namely a tall tale about a project called Los Bigotes Perfectos. You <laughs> that up? I knew that by planning a story about Metal Gear, I could get you to sneak into Tim's trap with me, and ultimately help me fake my own death in front of Tim's eyes. But what about Nick's, er, your brain? Don't tell me it was just a pile of spaghetti or something. Just another piece of misinformation I planned for the Secret Sand incident. That was all it took to convince both Tim and the president of the brain's existence. Yeah, it did seem a bit hard to believe that your brain could have managed to remain intact after a shot in the head. So in the end, it all had to do with belief, huh? Belief is a powerful thing. Tim used it to deceive the ghosts of Christmas past and to end Christmas once and for all. But in the end, it was your beliefs that prevailed. I don't see what my beliefs have to This is so apt. The Santa Claus snake. This entire <laughs> this is some serious Metal Gear Solid ending shit. In my existence. I don't believe in Santa Claus. <laughs> I'm too old for that crap. Though you'd even seen my dead body with your own eyes, in your heart you still held hope that I was alive. It was this belief alone that continued to allow me oh to my exist God. long after the assassination. Well, just don't go around telling everyone. I've got a reputation as a hard mercenary to uphold. <laughs> Your secret's safe with me. Well, I guess this means goodbye. Afraid it does. Chances are we'll never run into each other again. Not if we keep doing our jobs correctly, anyways. <laughs> goodbye, Snake. Merry Christmas, Santa Claus. Oh, God. The mission was a success. <laughs> Have yourself a Merry Christmas as well, Snake. And what? Happy New Gear. What just happened? I feel you approaching. I've waited all year. Oh, is, is it just the credits again? Let me see here. It's pretty much just the credits. All right, well, that was Merry Gear Solid, most of one, plus the ending and two. I don't believe there is. I understand completely. I guess it's like a Sopranos ending. Um, I don't believe there is a Merry Gear Solid three. Yeah, no, I don't think it's the thing. Oh, there's a little post credits thing again. This is like a Return of the King sort of situation. Like, you you think it's about to end, and then an hour later, you're watching the second set of credits. Jungle Bells. What? Oh my god. Outer Saving. Treetop Glisten Sentry Glisten. Happy Sting. These titles are great. The very next day you gave my position away. <laughs> he sees you when you're sneaking. Someday you Whoops. Cutscene music was my favorite music. Music sounds like naked women should be dancing in the credits. It does sound like some James Bond shit. I hear the latest Bond is like actually good. I stopped watching around uh, whatever the last Pierce Brosnan one was. Uh, Tomorrow Never Dies, I want to say. I mean, how do you top Goldeneye? But eh. I 
the SA goons. Oh no. I guess they were relevant around when these first ones came out, weren't they? Mary Gear Solid 2, Ghost of Christmas Past. Alright, there should be little text after this that hopefully explains things. So what happened? I don't know. <laughs> Same. It like I might have inhaled a bit too much of that sleeping gas. <laughs> I can't remember a thing after I wished you a Merry Christmas. Hmm. Yeah, your codec call cut out there too. Well, I assume you'd gotten into the Merry Gear. Oh, so. he's making him forget Why about not? Santa. I get I woke it. Up, the Merry Gear was gone. Oh. Well, at least we've got Tragic Tim. We can interrogate him once he wakes up. <laughs> Yes. It all went according to plan. Yes. They all entered their passcodes. But the merry gear is safely out of their hands. <laughs> what? It was as easy as hiding a package in the mission files. <laughs> they thought it was sleeping gas. <gasps> yeah. The poison gas was quite effective. <laughs> as was the forgetting serum. He won't remember. <laughs> Why are the mouth noises in the background? He had no idea. I'm convinced he'd believe anything after all that double and triple crossing. <gasps> Don't gaslight, Snake. The corroborating information we learned from playing Mary Gear Solid Secret Santa only convinced him further. <laughs> so he is, he is. VR training, my voice was nearly indistinguishable <gasps> from the original. What? The bloodlines of the three wise <laughs> men are cut, and the merry gear is ours. Oh shit, oh fuck. Not a single person can get in our way. If only the three wise men had been more complicit. Not a single one of them entered their passcode when they had the chance. Yes, the hi ho 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 <laughs> shall rise again. Shut the fuck up. Problems? <laughs> I assumed it was just a matter of... Bah! Humbug! Then put the warheads into boxes, you nincompoop! What is happening? Okay. Two hours, 21 minutes. Okay, that's that must not count, like, dying and stuff. Alert 75. Emily's throne, 54. Enemies polarized 28. Enemies in love and definitely not fucking killed. 5. Total items 9. Rank mammoth. I assume that's an insult. Rank. Oh. This is thing. I want to see what the. Oh, I delete your save when you're done. Previous ops. Alright. Well. That was Merry Gear Solid 2. Um, I think that's the whole series we've just played. If not, well, we'll play it next year, I guess. Um, we are streaming a bunch of Christmas YouTube poop stuff tomorrow. Um, and other various holiday things, I think. Um, and then Subnautica Below Zero. We're doing a seven days uh, seven days of streaming. We're doing streams every day this week because I'm off work and I wanted to catch up a little bit. So we're starting um, – we're finally starting Subnautica Below Zero because, you know, wintry. Why not? Um, YouTube poops tomorrow, like I said. What else have we got? We got a movie night. I'm not sure what we're going to play. We'll decide in the Discord. Um, and then there's a New Year's, New Year's drinking game stream we'll be doing, of course, on New Year's Eve. The war on Christmas stream. <laughs> of course it's a war on Christmas. Good night and to all a good... Uh, uh, wait, no. <laughs> That's not how that goes. Good night and to all a Merry Christmas or something. <laughs>